Rio, Rio the Great, great the one the girls love and haters love to hate. Hell yeah, man. What's good with you, bro? Man, I'm doing good. Hell yeah, that's what's blessed up. Blessed to be here. Man, I'm blessed that you came on time, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Niggas be coming up as late as hell. They be disrespectful as fuck, dog. Like, man. damn. I already know how it is with the with the artists, man. man. We be on that artist speed. Hell yeah, niggas be saying, fuck my Fa time. Fashionably late. <laughs> Can't nobody even see you. <laughs> man, for sure, for sure. Hell yeah. Well, shit, man, before we get into your story, your music, everything that you do, dog, we always start off with a salute me while I'm here. A lot of times, for niggas sure, be sure. waiting till you know, people pass away, and, you know what I'm saying, give them their flowers and shit. Or her, <laughs> you know yeah, what I'm saying. Sure. So instead, we try to do it while they can, you know, what I'm saying, still receive it. But you gotta be outside the box, man. It's always easy to say mom, dad, brother, sister. If you got kids, or whatever. Mm -hmm. So uh, somebody outside the box, man. Who can you think of off the rip, bro? Man, I got a bunch of them, but I'm gonna start with my homeboy Cam Woods. Yeah. My nigga Cam, the first person to give me a beat, first mm -hmm. person to record me. Hell you yeah. know what I'm saying, like. That shit was big, you know what I'm saying? My mm -hmm. nigga do everything. He shoot videos. He just shot my last video. For sure. He really like a hidden gem here in the city. Like yeah. he a one shot, he a one stop shop, man. Yeah. You could yeah. go get a beat with him. A What's feature. his name again? His name Cam Woods. Okay. Pineapple Cam on uh Instagram. He got his own clothing line and everything. But yeah. man, that, that, that's my boy, man. That's what's up. Hell let yeah. Me, let me give one more shout out oh, to ahead, my uh ahead. my DJ man, DJ Rampage man. He. Everybody need, you don't need a bunch of yes man when you in the music shit. You need mm -hmm. somebody that's going to be honest with you, that's sure. going to get, you know what I'm saying, making sure business and shit get done. So, Hell yeah. I appreciate him for ha having him in my corner and shit. You feel me? And yeah. then, he a DJ, you know what I'm saying? You got to show your love to your DJs. Yeah, hell yeah. So, you, need yeah. That, you need that shit for sure. You don't need a whole bunch of yes man, a whole bunch of niggas who going to be like this, that, and the third just to, you know what I'm saying? Just to please the, the artist or please they homie or something like that. You need somebody who's going to give you the truth and shit. Mm -hmm. My shit, dog, I really can't fucking think. Of, I was trying to think of somebody like a motherfucker salute, dog. I've been salute like a motherfucker, dog. Man. My shit is silly. I'm going to salute niggas who can smoke weed, bro. Yeah. Because, <laughs> nigga, that's something that I can't fucking handle, dog. Man. I can, the drinking is straight. I wish I, had, I wish I could smoke weed instead of drinking, dog. But every time I try to smoke weed, nigga, it's never good, bro. You like, got you to gotta try the papers, man. No, but my thing is that after effects, like, I'll be smoking... Nigga, one instance I was thinking about what the nigga was thinking about about me. So nigga, you are you say you are already I get a paranoid. Deep thinker. You already yeah. a deep thinker, so it so takes you to a whole other level. I'm thinking about <laughs> what my girl could have been doing to cheat on me, bro. Like damn, Tuesday that motherfucker usually get here at three fifty five. She came at four fifteen. <laughs> she <Nah>. got <laughs> like nigga. I'm thinking heavy, bro. Like I can't do that shit, bro. So nigga, just just the fact that you know what I'm saying niggas can smoke weed and still be regular ass niggas, dog. I salute y'all motherfuckers, man. You know what I'm saying? We got somebody. My oh, nigga yeah. Trice, man. Trice, dog. Right, we we Trice already talked, dog. Hey, what up, dog? Hey, hey, just know, nigga, I ain't skip over you, bro. He asked oh, no. me, bro. <laughs> 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 no, you good. You good. good. Well, shit, you down here, bro. We we did something called Salute Me While I'm Here, man. A lot of times, niggas be waiting for people to pass away and salute them. Okay. You got somebody you can salute real quick that's outside of the normal, like mom, dad, and shit like that? Um, shit, my nigga Feezy Fee, man. Okay. Oh, yeah, man. Shout out to oh, Feezy Fee, that's a, man. Hey, I, I just dropped a new single with Feezy Fee yesterday, man. I mean, can't make that nigga coming on the show, too. Like, yeah, you know, hey, hey, he's taking it over. This hard you, summer, man. You're putting a lot of people together that usually don't be together. Yeah. For real. So Hell, yeah. Yeah, big salute to Feezy Fee for sure, man. Hell, yeah, dog. Uh, matter of fact, I know y'all know the homie, man. Diddy, a.k.a. I'm about to call him, a.k.a. Deshaun, like that's not his real name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, that yeah. nigga, I Duke think he, and Dane, yeah, man. Yeah. He, he with Fee, you feel yeah. me? That's how I got, and that's how I met him was through Fee. Yeah. So she, you see what type of shit Fee, Yeah, on. and that's how I met all y'all niggas is through him, dog. Like, <laughs> like, every nah. time I see a AFP nigga, like, oh, this nigga got to be uh, some way. We changing the narrative Deshaun. in Highland Park, man. That's you know what I'm saying? Up. For real, like, I'm real big on that. Like, I really want to change the narrative of the city. Mm -hmm. I seen when Hustle and Stacks was on here, how they was talking about, like, you know what I'm saying, the memes and just Hell the bad, yeah. you know what I'm saying, that bad stick with that high for you know what I'm saying, for no reason, for real, like, it's a lot of good people that come from oh, HP, yeah. a lot of genuine people. Hell yeah. Um, despite, you know what I'm saying, the circumstances, we done rose from the bottom. Yeah, hell when yeah. When you go out of town and you talk about, you tell somebody you from Detroit, yeah. they like, damn, you from the D. <laughs> yeah, we, so we, when we, you in Detroit, you tell somebody you from HP, they like, damn, you from HP? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, that's where we come from and shit. So, you know what I'm saying? No, that's funny as hell. We, we changing that, man. Got but, to. Man, shout out to my city, though, man. I just, uh, just like two, three days ago, I just went and put nets up in my old elementary school. Oh, yeah, uh, I seen Barbara. that. Nigga, that's funny you, you say that shit. We used to do that shit all the time in my old hood, dog, Crowley, dog. 
You got you got to do that shit, man. Take care of the block. Take care of the motherfucking hood, dog. For real. Yep, and it just be little shit. Like, man, I remember being a little nigga coming up there. First hot day of the summer, man. Double rails, no nets and shit. It's like, oh man, yeah, like I nigga. used to just wish somebody would come and get us. No, them no nets on a double rim is terrible, nigga. Man, make him <laughs> out here want to hoop for real. That shit pure as hell. <laughs> no, if you can show that bitch, you got a motherfucking stealth jumper, dog. You like, be bad as hell. Yo. You shoot that, that bitch all net, that bitch just bounce all the way through the. Dog. Dog. You got to make sure you got a little arc in that you bitch too. Light, just shoot light. Man, don't put too much force on that bitch to get in there. Dog, cause that motherfucker will rim the fuck out. You be mad as hell, nigga. You miss layups. That bitch, if you fuck around, do it wrong, dog. Bad. Double fucking rims, nigga. You know you good. You come up on them double rims. Hold on, nigga. Be, bitches. So I don't know how old y'all are, dog. But nigga, we used to be on them crates heavy. Like, oh, that was my crate. first round was a crate, nigga. I ain't gonna lie. I, I was a little spoiled. I, I had, had, <laughs> nigga had real. I had a rim in the backyard. I used to be jealous. Other niggas had rims, so when I got my hops, I used to break <laughs> niggas' rims. <rim. laughs> I used to go through the hood like, yeah, we about to go break that rim, bro. Come on, man. No, the crate nigga. You get you a master jumper on the crate, nigga. You oh, legit, yeah, you nigga. special. I was a crate king in that bitch, nigga. Crate king shot, nigga. Man, 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 shooting the fuck out that motherfucker in the crate, dog. Crate curry. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. But shit, man, before we get into the music, man, you already touched on being on from, from HP and shit, dog. But mm -hmm. tell me how it was when you was motherfucking Lil Rio, dog. When you was at the crib and you was really eight, nigga. <laughs> man, growing up at HP was crazy. Like, I'm my mom's only child. You know okay. what I'm saying? We grew up with my granny. Yeah. Um,. Shit, I had a bunch of like cousins. All my, I'm the only '90s baby. All my cousins, '80s babies, yeah, older yeah. than me and shit. So shit, it was like survival. You know what I'm saying? They, all my family, they all got like they uh, brothers and sisters. Yeah, yeah. You know how that is? Yeah, you like, know shit. Yeah, so I, it made me real smart. It made me real like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? By the time I'm like six and seven, I'm whipping my cousins and chess checkers, Hell video yeah. games, anything. It's like you're about to outsmart <laughs> me. Nigga, pet up his head. Y'all might, yeah, might be bigger than me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So by the time it started catching up, by the time I start, uh, you know what I'm saying, my size and stuff, like yeah. the kids my age, yeah. man, I used to be playing basketball, three on one, Hell two yeah. on one, like shit, yeah. all y'all against me, like, man, man, for real, like I was super competitive. I'm about to like, say, now y'all talking about hooping, y'all got game for real though? Man, I still hoop, bro. I'm I was busting niggas ass. I was just, <laughs> I, after, after I, still I put the it. nets up at the court, yeah. I hoop, I, I run I with the young no niggas, team, man. I, I got them bitches for sure. <laughs> Cause that's the one thing about it, bro, like, I hate. That, that shit fucked me up, dog. My nigga, I remember my nigga, dog. I ain't gonna say his name out here, dog. <laughs> that, that nigga was in the bitch like, I can hoop, I can hoop. So we used to oh, hoop. Shit. That nigga came up there, I'm like, that just changed my whole outlook on that nigga, dog. <laughs> like, yeah, I know like, a lot of niggas. You should have kept it real and said you was decent, nigga. Yeah. You know niggas ain't gonna never say they nah. decent. Yeah, <laughs> like, I'm straight. Never. I had a nigga one time who told me he was nice. I went to hoop with this nigga. <laughs> And I took this nigga whole sack. You man. feel me? We played gram for gram. Yeah. And I ran that nigga whole sack, <laughs> double or nothing. Seven zero. I was fucking him. I thought you said you can hoop. Duh. That's Dancing the worst thing. I That's smoked what... it with him. Though. I never get my, myself too high. I be like, yeah, I'm decent. You know what I'm saying? They pick me on the team. And then if I do good, then you be like, oh, shit, nigga. You know what I'm saying? This nigga can hoop for real. Or if I fuck up, they be like, damn, that nigga did say he could just hoop a See, little See, I know my role. <laughs> like, I get out there. Yeah. If I need to just play defense, I'll play defense. If I need to facilitate, I'll facilitate. Mm -hmm. I ain't trying to be Curry. I ain't hell coming yeah. up with them half-court jumpers, man. Yeah, for sure. Hell yeah. Curry that fucked up the game and, like, the, you know what I'm saying, the Dog. street parks and shit. You be playing with a little young nigga coming up, Dog. find that bitch, you ready to quit. Like, what <laughs> yeah. the fuck wrong with you? Everybody at the three-point line, <laughs> nigga. Niggas came and shoot the free throw in that bitch. Man. Shoot threes, nigga. Dog, that shit crazy as hell. They ain't no lot. Man. So they be shooting the shit so, out that bitch. But yeah, yeah, I still get out there and hoop, man. I remember a couple... Summers ago, I was out at the basketball court. They like, what school you hoop for? They, I'm you like, bro, I'm yeah. Yeah, bro, I'm this is it. No, I'm <laughs> oh, shit. Hell yeah, appreciate it, though. Hell yeah, so nigga, you said uh, hooping. You had hoop dreams coming up? Like, was, like, Man, you, uh, I did, bro. Dreams. So... <clears throat> Coming up in Highland Park, uh, that was my thing. Like I uh, played basketball. Yeah. I think I started playing like fifth, sixth grade. Yeah. yeah. At Barber, seventh grade. I was the only uh, seventh grader on the yeah. middle school hey, team. Hey, we got seven eighth graders. Yeah. yeah hey, I was yeah. the only seventh grader that made it. Yeah. So eighth grade, that was my team. You yeah, know what I'm yeah. saying? Being coach was locked in. Down there, let me pick all my boys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? After that, um, 
I was smart, you know what I'm saying? My grades was good. I was yeah. getting a 4.0 student. Hey, we still got house phone this bitch, dog. Old school granddad upstairs. Oh, yeah. Hey, it's all good. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. Good but, podcast. <laughs> my granddad <laughs> granddad had the same phone number for probably like 60 years, no cap. Duh, hell yeah, for like, sure. Like, since phone numbers probably came out for real, like, <laughs> phone yeah. number ain't never changed. Duh, hell yeah. You, you get locked up, you know that one person you can call. Yeah, yeah. For, real. for real. So you say high school, you in, hoop, you in high school? So high school, I went to cash, man. I bullshit you not. After like just really turning up in Highland Park, being the captain, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I probably lost probably two games my middle school, you know what I'm saying, in middle school. Yeah. I got cut off of my size, like yeah. first child. But yeah. the way Cass was going from like Highland Park, Cass, the school was so big. Mm. I was probably the only person from Highland Park, like in that motherfucker. To come out the district that year. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And yeah. then I think we had a hundred and fifty 150 people trial for JV. Duh. <laughs> yeah. Duh. The first trial was I just le- it was just uh, layups, left hand, right hand layups. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. got cut just off of how big I was. I'm Duh. like, do you know how young nigga? Duh. Like, Duh. <laughs> Duh. That's how I was on with the SC, dog. Southeastern, bro. That's crazy. Nigga, when I went to trials, bro, nigga, we they only had one spot yeah. available. And it was like 80 niggas in that enough. bitch, dog. Oh, you want big enough. Yeah. It was like 80 niggas in that bitch trying out for one spot, bro. Yeah. And of course, they gave that shit to this nigga named Cornbread. Never forget that shit. This nigga like 6'6", six, six, dog. Made that bitch, man. Fuck you, Cornbread. High school, bro. Yeah. A lot of high school <laughs> politics. It was a lot of man, politics in that yeah. shit, man. Hell like, that yeah. That but like the next no, year. Hell yeah, for sure, Purge. The very trial for the day. <laughs> I'm like, shit, I know I ain't gonna do <laughs> Too many Yeah, you but, gotta know the coach. That, yeah. that very next year, I ain't grow. I ain't do shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I was starting. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Went from like. Yeah, not making that bitch. To being a starting point guard and shit. Yeah. Shit, I bought out my 10th grade year. The next. Uh, as soon as. Soon as motherfucking basketball season was over, uh, my mom, she was one of them, you about to get a job, you about to work, about to keep me yeah. doing something. She had me working, man. I was at McDonald's, 16, man. leaving school, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. After eight hours of motherfucking school, yeah. going to put in that little working McDonald's and shit. Hell yeah. She, I was like 16, I had my car, you know what I'm saying, paying my phone bill and yeah. shit. Hell yeah. Man, motherfucking school came around that next year. Yeah. My grades dropped from like a 3.7 to like a 1.7. <laughs> Quick as hell. <laughs> no, that's how shit be. Working, girls, you know what I'm Man, saying? Man, they'll fuck it up. But I couldn't even, I wasn't eligible. Yeah. I was ineligible going into my first year of varsity. Shit, it was just, I ended up transferring. Yeah. I ended up going to uh, Robichard. Okay. Out there in Dearborn Heights. Yeah. And that's where I ended up graduating from. Okay, okay, okay. Hell yeah. yeah. By the time I got there, man, with the basketball they shit, had they, squad. they was loaded, bro. They yeah. had, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Bunch of, they, I think we're on the side of the whole starting fire with uh, D1. Yeah, damn. They was loaded. <laughs> Hell yeah. For real. That's how it should be, man. But shit, go back a little bit. You said that it was just uh, you only, only child shit. You got mom and dad at the crib. Like, nigga, what you ever looking like, nigga? So, my, I grew up... Uh, only child, but like, well, I don't ever remember my mom and dad being together. Oh, okay, think, was, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So but what? my dad was around, though. Don't get oh, me wrong. Right, my dad bet. come grab me every fucking weekend and shit. Type, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, hell yeah. Go kick it with him and shit. Damn, this nigga <clears throat> two blunts in rotation. <laughs> I thought y'all niggas smoked. I didn't know that. Hell no. Nah. So I, what? I smoked just now when I'm producing. Yeah, okay. he fuck up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so was every time nigga, you was like, damn. I, like, would you ever judge the niggas who have brothers and sisters? Like, I'm gonna be by myself playing wrestling man and shit by man. myself. <laughs> Tag by my goddamn self. Man, I, I used to always, like, <laughs> want company, you know what I'm saying? I spent so much a long time growing up, yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, I ain't even, I had all the games and shit, but it's like, you don't want to sit there and play motherfucking PlayStation by yourself. <laughs> yeah, because you, know you couldn't be online then. Yeah, you don't want to sit there playing Live 97, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Busting the computer ass. That's what Jordan went on the game. You got Player 24. Dog. Oh, Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Jordan Trump probably would not be yeah. on the fucking, uh, on the NBA Live. I think I the NBA last time I see you before I see you. Yeah. I think I went to this nigga. We was in second grade together. This nigga. This nigga tries to be my best friend in first grade. I swear to God, bro. Duh. It did. Second grade, and then I left and went to a whole other school. I ain't seen this nigga till seventh grade. That Damn. Day. Right. Yeah, <laughs> I swear to really. God. Duh. I ain't seen this nigga till That's seven. dope at NBA Live, nigga. When 2K came out, I was like, fuck that shit, though. Fuck Live, cuz. Yeah, I remember. The, I still got my second Dreamcast with the first 2K on that bitch. Nigga, I was yeah. Iverson, nigga. Oh, and that's when he had, what's that, uh, Afro Thunder and Ray Rumble and shit, yeah. though? Yeah, oh, yeah. That was Crazy classic. Texas. And shit, dude. Yeah. That was my best Christmas ever, nigga. Got that uh, that dream, <laughs> dream cast, cast. Nigga. nigga. I thought I was the man, nigga. Yeah, that's when I had NFL 2K, nigga. 
Mm-hmm. That shit throwback for real. Randy though. Moss. Randy yeah. Moss on the cover. Hell yeah, hell yeah. See all that bitch. Uh-huh. Hell yeah. We no. out here showing our age, man. Hell Damn. yeah, nigga. Old as, I'm old as fuck. I'm old as dirt, <laughs> nigga. I'm mad as hell about it too, nigga. My son 14 be looking at me crazy like, you old ass nigga. My <laughs> man, fuck your young ass. <laughs> but yeah. shit, dog. Go back a little bit. For uh, sure, for sure. Usually you get your musical influences from your from your parents, dog, or like people older. So who were mm-hmm. some people that you was liking just based off your mom or your dad, dog? Man, my mom and dad is like day and night when it comes to the music shit. Yeah. So my mom was Jill Scott, hey, Erica man, Jill Badu. Scott, for sure, Erica yeah. Badu, like, yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But my pops, man, my pops was putting me up to like all the hip shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? DMX, I remember hearing my first with uh, Stop. Hell yeah. Drop. When that it. shit uh, came out, I remember just being in the back seat with my pops. Hell yeah. You got his uh, riding around and shit. You know what I'm yeah. saying? The end. Talk is cheap, motherfucker. Hell I remember yeah. him screaming yeah. out the window and shit. Like, mm-hmm. that shit was turnt. But my pops put me on a lot of shit, man. He put me on Webby. I remember Nigga sleep on Webby dog Man I remember When I first started driving Like driver's training Me and my pops Took a trip down to Carolina To see some family down there Yeah And that was like My first time getting to Like drive on the road And shit He had a whole bunch of CDs Picked out You know what I'm saying For the ride Hell yeah I remember he popped in that Webby Like midway through I'm like, what the fuck is this? Oh, like, that Savage yeah. Life 1 Tell yeah. me what you know about me No, hell yeah Man, what? That, that nigga was cold, crazy, bro. Man. Hey, it's it's funny, dog, cause like the, the way you the way you rap and shit, you kind of like you can kind of see you got some influences from that type of shit, like that hype music, that feel good music, talk shit. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm just before I started doing music, I just started doing music, man. Probably year year and a half ago. But yeah. before I started doing music, yeah. I was a big fan of music. Yeah, hell you know yeah, what I'm you saying? gotta be big yeah. fan of music. Like I didn't. Just say, oh, I want to do it because such and such yeah, and such, yeah. such. It was just like, nigga, rapping was like going to the league growing up. Yeah. You know yeah, what I'm saying? In yeah. a sense, it yeah, was like, sure. a lot of that shit seemed accessible now. Like, we got niggas who, oh, you ain't going to go to the league. You ain't gonna, they playing overseas. I got niggas who no, didn't, sure. didn't start in high school that's balling right now. Like, yeah. top 10 player, you know what I'm saying, Hell overseas yeah. and shit. Shout out to my nigga T-Biggs, man. Hell yeah, shit. Yeah, you get, get some good money over there, nigga, for real, so you shit. You getting paid to do what you love. Hell yeah, I'm you good. You paid to hoop every day? What? Hell yeah, <laughs> I'm with it, dog. <laughs> Hell yeah, dog. I'm with it, dog. Uh, so shit, balling. talk about, talk, you said who you liking because your mom and shit and your pops. Give me this. Give me a, both of y'all can answer this, dog. Give me a song or a CD that when you hear every time you think about a certain moment in your life, bro. Like, if you hear a song, you think about Keisha, or you think about where you was at, dog, your first fight. Like, give me a song or a CD every time you hear it, you think about this particular time. I'd say the most influential uh, CD that I got like that is Wiz uh, Cushion Orange Juice. Yeah, hell yeah. When that Cushion Orange Juice dropped, man, I was in college. I was trying to figure that shit out. My second year, shit was getting rough. Yeah. Living on campus. I got in some little trouble, caught with some weed on the break yeah. up here. So they got me on probation in Southfield and shit. Yeah. Every time I come here, I got to pay that little money yeah. and shit, yeah. man. Yeah. You say cushion orange juice? Man, That's cushion orange juice. When that shit dropped, man, I classic. remember it was, a, it was a chick down there. She was a... Uh, Man, she was fucking on Wiz before the, uh, yeah. you know what I'm saying, before the fame and shit. Hell yeah. She used to always be hyping them up like, yeah, hey, this nigga right, right. Yeah. And you drop that shit, man, that shit hit the campus, dog. I just remember everybody being outside, just smoking. Hell yeah. And that shit was illegal as fuck back then, yeah. too. You know and, uh, what I'm saying? Yeah, that one song, that pedal to the metal. That shit was hard. Uh-huh. Like, that whole shit was hard, up, bro. Up was the song up. for me, man. Yeah. Sitting in the motherfucking, uh, man, that's when everybody used to hot box when you used to just sit in the car. Duh. Motherfucking sweaty as hell, windows yeah, up. Yeah, fucked up. About three, four blunts of Reggie's going around. <laughs> they're Reggibles. Man, hell yeah. Man. That's when they used to go in on them 10 bags. Hell yeah. You're high <laughs> as hell, dog. What about you, Trice, dog? What's a song or a CD you think about, bro? Take you back to a time. Shit, <laughs> screws the controversy. Yeah. Ooh. I remember we used to. We was wild. We was getting it in around that time. And that's what we came up with our name, the Pillar Boys, off that song. We were like straight from the Pillar Boy. Mm-hmm. We started calling ourselves the Pillar Boys. Yeah. And then everybody else started calling themselves the Pillar Boys too. But we ain't gonna go there. But, yeah. Oh okay, yeah, we gonna get. Oh, but you know, that was that CD. Like I remember us being active, being out there. And that song, we just playing that CD every day, every Hell day. And yeah. I thought that was the hardest shit. Yeah, yeah. Still is to, to me, cause the hardest CD that came out at HP. I don't yeah. give a fuck with no I ain't gonna lie. I remember when uh, I had to be in seventh grade when Blaze dropped motherfucking Stackmaster. Yeah. 
Hell Man, yeah. that shit changed my life, bro. <laughs> what Dog, the fuck is this? The song, the CD has uh, changed my shit, bro. Was a uh, KDZ. Okay. That motherfucker stuck in my ways. Man, I remember seeing yeah, them videos on tablets. Remember yeah, the box? Nigga. Tunnel 16. I, I remember yeah. him and Juan on the ground, nigga, with the money. Count my, my dope. dope money. <laughs> Count my dope money. Like, no, that shit was hard as hell Juan to me. Goat, I remember bro. growing up trying to, like, find that shit oh, yeah. for years and years. Like, dude, this, did that shit really happen? <laughs> like, did, I bought exist? that motherfucking album from Chantanix for $23, nigga. The real boy. Yeah. Arm and Hammer case, nigga. I just played that shit every day. They had BG on that motherfucker, dog. That's when they had Short Dog on there. I don't know if they remember Short Dog. Yeah. He was from, uh, he from Houston, but he's been in Detroit, dog, heavy. Yeah. Nigga, that shit, that count my dope money. What was that one uh, uh, that they used to play in a song all the time? Uh, uh, yo, what hood you from and shit, dog? Like, yeah. nigga, KDZ is a nigga mm-hmm. who don't get talked about a lot on the Detroit scene, bro. He don't get his flowers for sure. Yeah, and yeah. now he, you know what I'm saying, back in the scene with the music and shit. I mean, yeah. not the music, the movies. Yeah, if I say he acting heavy. So. Yeah, what's Hell, that? Yeah. Damn, what you was tell the, he never uh, a good relationship because he ain't got fat. Nigga, he got healthy. See, you know when they get healthy, they ain't in a good relationship, dog. They happy as hell, dog. Because mm-hmm. <laughs> they don't give a fuck about nothing, dog. It's just eating yeah, good. Man. Shout out to all the Detroit legends, man. Whenever I see somebody around here, like even before the music shit, I bump into just random people. Stretch Money, yeah. KDZ, the Dope Boys, man. Hell yeah. <clears throat> what up, dog, man? You a Detroit legend. Hell yeah, yeah. First thing sure. I say, because... Shit, you can't deny it. We yeah. all know who they is. Not- you know what I'm saying? I try to show love before... You know what I'm saying? Any other emotions start to, you know what I'm saying, pop yeah. up and shit. A lot of people, they don't know how to show love. They don't know how to be like, damn, that's such and such. Hell yeah. They be thinking everything is dick sucker. So. Nigga, one thing though, dog, I hate meeting a nigga who I fuck with and then you find out they asshole. <laughs> like, that's why. <what> yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, for real, because that, that, that got hurt, especially when you younger, dog. Like, you didn't fuck with this nigga or that, you know what I'm saying, I hurt. And you see him like, damn, this motherfucker terrible. This nigga weak as fuck, gay. Yeah, not, not, you ain't gay. No disrespect to the gays and shit, but yeah, oh ho ass nigga, yeah, man, like that nigga soft as hell. Yeah, so I, I like, I don't. I, sometimes I, I don't just, put niggas on the pedestal, but yeah. like, I, like I say, I do show love though. You yeah. know what I'm saying? What for I sure, no. Say. Now I usually ask for, like, for niggas top five. Like I try to say top five without being, you know, saying the most obvious shit with Pac and shit. But you got a Detroit top five, bro? Oh, my Detroit top five. Or shit, just y'all from HP, it. nigga. Just Michigan top five, nigga. Fuck. I could do an H. I ain't gonna do the HP top five, cause everybody <laughs> in my top five for HP. I fuck with everybody <laughs> for the city for real. Hell yeah. But uh, as far as like Detroit, man, I was a Babyface Ray uh fan for a long time yeah, before yeah. he just started to He's catch his way, up, yeah. man. That was somebody who I just on the road listening to, you know what I'm saying? Sure. Poppy and Ray, I listen to him for two hours straight, yeah. rapping everywhere, you know Hell what I'm yeah. saying? Not nodding off, falling asleep, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. I fuck with his music off of that, like, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? It might not be the most club song, it might yeah. not be the most whatever, but it got listening value. For sure, for I'm sure. I'm listening over and over again, so. Hell Definitely yeah. throw Ray in there, man. <clears throat> uh, payroll, you know what yeah. I'm saying? That's what, yeah, Payroll code, uh Pay a legend, man. Hell yeah, that nigga, like, to me, he, he, like, he like, motivate the streets yeah, the way he that tells nigga stories. Make you go do some shit, dog. Like, the way he <laughs> rap, man, he make you want to get in the booth and not just like you can't just he he come with it. You yeah, feel for me? sure. Hell yeah, he talking shit. He come with it. Um, a lot of people don't put a uh, big shine in the category of motherfucking yeah. Detroit rappers, but he a fucking legend, bro. Hell yeah, for sure. He did Hell it yeah. in a way that was like. Nigga, unheard of. Like, yeah. rapping outside of the studio, like, really Man, in my rap bag yeah. to where Kanye just like, yeah, I got I'm fuck with you. you. Hell yeah. Exactly. Now, you got fuck with People bitch, discredit huh? that. Like, yeah. that was big. And then, after the fact, how many number one songs he had. I think with him, bro, I think a lot of niggas, like... They like, want so much from yeah, him. Yeah, and they stop fucking with you, like, once you blow up to a certain category, dog, or a certain level. Niggas be like, you know what, dog? Like, we fuck with you when you was on the come up, but now that you and Kane so far up, it'd be a lot of times it'd be jealousy, too, though. I feel like people be wanting shit. They be yeah. like, damn, he from Detroit. He's supposed to be putting on for yeah. my cousin. He's yeah. supposed to be putting yeah. on for, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I it's think, like, you can, only, just, you can only do so much. But as far it. as the music, though, yeah. Big Sean definitely, you know what I'm saying? You got to give him his flowers. Yeah, what you saying about him? I was, I was just saying, I think niggas just used to Detroit niggas making a certain kind of music. So when Big Sean came out, niggas was disappointed because they was like, yeah. He ain't making that yeah. shit that we play. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That, that mm-hmm. we want everybody to know about. You feel yeah. me and shit. But I mean, he shit wasn't garbage. Yeah, you no, know? it wasn't garbage at all. Hell no. Yeah, but it just was like it was just like damn. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> but that's how niggas feel about M. Like yeah, not, that, that's, like, that's the same never, situation. M never really fought with nobody in Detroit. 
heavy besides the niggas he came up with. You feel me? Like D12, he came up with them niggas. Proof, he came up with him. Mm-hmm. Roy's like those niggas he came up with. But you know what I'm saying? I fuck with him when he first started, but as he got older, I felt like he was just like just rapping, just to be rapping. Like Wayne is my favorite rapper, one of them. But that's, at a certain point, hands just, down my favorite. Yeah, but at a certain point, I felt like nigga Until like man left. Yeah, yeah, I'm like you can spit. But you ain't saying this shit. You can spit all day, like, but now you ain't really saying nothing no more. And I love Wayne. That's my top five. I feel the same. You could way. tell when like the that they just saying it and that feeling yeah. not really behind it. You For know sure. what I'm saying? It's one thing to just I go in there and say the sweetest shit ever. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But when I really mean that shit. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You, you you feel that shit. Man, for sure. Hell yeah. So you say you got you got Sean Pay. Motherfucker, uh, baby, uh, face, baby right. face. You got two more, bro. Uh, man, gotta throw Soda Baby in there. Yeah, you can't deny what Soda Soda oh, Baby yeah. is a one man army. Like, <laughs> bro, yeah. he, that nigga do everything. Dance, motherfucker, rap. That bro, nigga, he no. a, a one man show for real. Like, you can't take away from. He made his own lane and ran with that shit. For like. Sure. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like can't hate on that shit at all. That nigga be yeah, that nigga, nigga animal, bro. <laughs> I, 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 I could I could just know I know that nigga probably going on his performances like a motherfucker, probably. Man, everything like he he take it so serious. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. <clears throat> um then for the last one, Detroit rapper, I dare not have to throw Peasy in there. Yeah, now um, I ain't gonna lie, I just got hip to Peasy like nigga a couple months ago. I yeah, knew about him, but yeah. I never really fucked with his music for real. I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah. I fuck with Peasy <laughs> hard, bro. <laughs> like dog, baby face Ray. Peasy like it just it was these young niggas in my job, like dog kept talking about. So my brother kept talking about so I'm like, let me listen to these niggas, dog. Yeah. I'm like damn these niggas ain't bad. All Star JR, like these niggas I just started listening to, dog. All Star Within this JR. year, bro. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Duh, so, for real, duh. So shit, man, shout y'all HP niggas out who rap, dog. Let, uh, fuck this Detroit nigga, y'all from HP. Let, let us know right. some rappers that we should be looking out for. So let me shout out my nigga Ice Dolo, man. My nigga on fire right now. That nigga talented, bro. Yeah. That nigga talented, man. He got the he got the wave. He got the juice. <laughs> yeah. See, it's just a matter of you know what I'm saying. People yeah, hearing yeah. him. Once that's, he, that's the once, hard part. Once he heard whatever, he he out of here, man. He got it. He got the work ethic. All For that. Sure. Hell yeah. Shout um, out. Shit, my young nigga Kev Honcho. Yeah. Y'all hit the Kev Honcho. I heard that name, dog. I heard that name. For but sure. But this young nigga just turned 21. This nigga is yeah. Kev Star, bro. Yeah. I don't know no other way to say it. Like, I I learned a lot of shit from other artists. You know yeah. what I'm saying? From like. Watching, not just like listening to him. Like I, I got hit to uh, Kev. I went to a performance um, showcase uh, at the I Rock local. Okay. It's on Woodward and Glendale. Um, shout out to my young nigga Karan too. Yeah. He from uh, Highland Park. Okay. He, uh, him and he, him and his people are on that spot. Okay. They have showcases there. They got yeah. a studio in the basement. They still be on showcase there now. Yep. They okay. have the one tonight actually. Mm-hmm. R and B showcase. Mm-hmm. But um, man, I uh, got hit to Kev there. Yeah. He was there performing, came in, Hard rocked hell. that bitch. I'm like, dog, the fuck <laughs> had the whole crowd. It was like, I went to a concert. <laughs> like, like, nigga was still performing. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, gotta go like three songs later. Like, Stop. this nigga just rocked hell this yeah. bitch. Like, hell yeah. real. So afterwards, oh, I had. He got oh hell yeah star power. You know what I'm saying? You can't mm-hmm. you can't teach that. Yeah, for sure. Hell yeah. But um. I bumped into him afterwards, like, shit, you know what I'm saying? Where your music at? I'm trying to find this shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? He like, shit, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I linked in with him, and I started helping him get his music, you know what I'm saying, put out and shit. Mm-hmm. Bro, he a star, bro. Hell yeah. He got it, but I fuck with him. But that's it, a lot about you, because, nigga, <clears throat> you do the same music. A lot of times, you could just been hating on him, not even fuck with him, because nah, you see how... We change, we changing the narrative, bro, I need to do because that shit, though. If, nice like I say, I'm a, yeah. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a new artist, so if I see... I could help you with something. Yeah. Why not? Why yeah. would I be? It, it ain't That's go, how it's supposed to be. It ain't gonna fucking hurt me to yeah. see you uh, blow. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But a lot of niggas be scared to see another nigga blow before them. You feel me? Terrified. It's enough money out here for everybody. It's enough. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's enough everything for everybody, man. Hell yeah. We come together and it, we we an unstoppable force. That's what y'all want to see. Sure. Cause it, it don't cost shit to show love to a nigga, dog. Like, shit. That shit free as hell. Uh, shit. Free nine nine. It could just be anything. You know what I'm saying? Me, my nigga Trice, bro. 
Me yeah. and this nigga, uh, I didn't know Trice since I was like five, six. We was like best friends in, you know what I'm saying, yeah. grade school. Hell yeah. Then, you know what I'm saying, our parents moved us apart. Yeah. You know how that shit is. Yeah. There wasn't no social media back then. There wasn't no, you know what I'm saying, they tapped in on Instagram. Where you like, been at, dog? Like, yeah. Hell yeah. But you know what I'm saying, um, mu the music brought us back together. My nigga called, bro. Yeah. They got uh, a new single out right now, Karen. Yeah. That bitch hard. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, hell yeah, Booty dog. talk, man. That bitch a banger. When I first heard <laughs> that bitch, I swear to God, I was on his head every day. Like, bro, I'm listening to this bitch in my motherfucking notes. Like, go upload this bitch so you get some streams, yeah. at least from me. Because this is yeah. a motherfucking banger. Yeah, I want to listen to shit in my emails. You <laughs> feel me? Like, I didn't listen to about 100 times in email. No, like, for sure, for sure. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, Shit, just just motivating, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pushing my pushing my uh people, iron sharp and iron. Oh yeah, hell yeah. You know what I'm sure. saying? So, that too. so that's too. that's the uh that's the motivating HP. But it's so many of us, bro. HP trikes, oh, like yeah. I just said, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. We got the uh get, get rich the mission niggas. Man, DJ, shout out to DJ, DJ, bro. DJ, yeah, I fuck with DJ, yeah, yeah, hell yeah. 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 But that's the thing I like about y'all niggas, dog. Cause Splash like, Brothers. Splash Brothers hustling, uh <clears throat> Hustling stacks, uh, yeah. Jay Floss, yeah. um, man, my uh, HP Dan man, uh, can't forget about the young niggas, OTM Brand, he was on my album, oh, yeah, yep, yep, Sunshine, yep, 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 yeah, but that's the thing I like, I fuck with y'all niggas on though, y'all, y'all rep HP hard as hell, cause it'd be easy just to be like, all right, everybody know Detroit, I'm from Detroit, or you yeah. know what I'm saying, cause I know when I was out of town, I was staying in Texas. Niggas just be from Michigan. First thing they ain't gonna say Detroit because everybody know Detroit. They be from Saginaw. Yeah, no, matter of fact, I'm glad I'm glad you say that shit. Cause like my barber was, you know what I'm saying, cut me up when I had hair, dog. Rest peace to my hair and shit. But uh <laughs> my barber was like, dog, there's one nigga I cut from Detroit. I'm like, oh for oh, oh straight up? I'm like, all right, shit. So we was we wound up being in the same barber shop. He like, dog, that's my Detroit nigga right there. So I'm like, oh shit, what high school you went to, bro? Like Saginaw High. I'm like, Mm -hmm. Nigga, so you mean to tell me you went from Detroit to Saginaw High? Yeah, I, day. <laughs> I told my barber like, dog, that nigga from Saginaw, nigga, like, right? Niggas be from Belleville, yeah. all type oh, of shit. Oh, you be like, nigga, where you from? East side, West side? They, they start looking crazy, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah, yeah, it's it's easy to be like just Detroit, but I respect y'all for you know what I'm saying showing love to y'all city and oh, and, put, and putting that I shit on. Right oh yeah, else. man. Hell yeah, because like I said, it'd be easy to just be like, I'm from Detroit or now nah, Flint. That's the popular thing to say because that's what niggas know. You know what I'm saying? Outside Michigan. Shout out to Rio the Ergo G, man. I got a oh, yeah, free got Rio, a man. Your free to go. Yeah, a song called Rio on that motherfucker, dog. Man, you want to hear the story about how that happened? What up, though? Man, we going to go shoot the video or whatever. Me, Trice, and our homeboy, DZ and shit. So, uh, the, song, the song called Shoe Doctor. Yeah. So, we supposed to shoot it at Shoe Doctor shoe or whatever, doctor, man. Yeah, yeah. So, we go up there, man. It's a misunderstanding. Mm-hmm. He ain't up there, he gone, everybody gone, his mom up there, like, video, mm -hmm. like, you know what I'm saying, like, no, I'm not up here, like, yeah. you feel me, so, I'm like, damn, so I got, we got everybody, we got the video, dude, so, <laughs> man, I got a, uh, shout out to my homeboy, Paul, man, I got an Asian dude named Paul, yeah, he, he, just one of them random good ass friends, man. Yeah, yeah. Like, I ain't even make it there yet. Man, <laughs> all this shit happened, I ain't even make it there. Man, he's just a good ass yeah. friend, man. He's just pulling up to show some love or whatever. But uh, he 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 got the he the plug on the gym shoes. Okay, okay. You need some Jordans, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeezys and shit. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Go tap me in with Paul. So he pull up, he about to show some love and shit. We just all sitting outside with the boo boo face, like damn. Yeah, yeah. Ain't no he video. like shit. I just dropped some shoes off at the uh, shoe trap and shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Y'all yeah. want to shoot it up there? I can make yeah. the call. Okay. Like, right. Hey man, go ahead. Whatever. Yeah. At this point, Paul make the call. <clears throat> There's people over there like, yeah, we already got somebody shooting the video over here. Right, right. right. Yeah. right, right, right. He like about to Facetime you. Yeah. So he Facetime me. Yeah, me the thing. Bro, had uh, Rio the Young OG the farm. Yeah. I'm just sitting there like, bro, <laughs> yeah. I just shoot this video. Yeah. Niggas in the motherfucker. He's like, man, it's all good. We up here shooting too. Pull up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah like, bet. Yeah, you know oh, what I'm saying? Yeah. So, man, it was literally, we got there. It was him, uh, Mike, Grindhart, E. Um, they, they in there working. You know yeah. what I'm saying? They shooting and shit. We, uh, man, we come in, we spill it out. I'm like, fuck it, let's get to work. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, Shit, we get to shooting our shit. You know what I'm saying? Up. We uh might be in like the front part of the mm -hmm. uh, story. They in the back. They moved to the uh, front. We yeah. moved yeah, yeah, outside. Just, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? We rotating. Shit, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just working. You know what I'm saying? So, 
shit, he seen our, uh, he seen how I was moving or whatever. I cut right into him, like, yeah. man, like, what's up? What you, my name Rio, your name Rio, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. He was like mixing me up with you anyway yeah. and shit, man. What's up, man? What you trying to do? Shit. He seen I was serious, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Gave me the number. I was at the studio with him the next night, man. Man, hell yeah. Took advantage of that opportunity. Like that. Yeah. Got you a motherfucking... You still got to shoot the video. Yeah. And get you a motherfucking feature from for a hot nigga right now and shit. Yeah, man. Hell that yeah. was big. And it was organic. It wasn't like, man, I got to get a song with this yeah, nigga for real. Sure. Yeah, you know what happened. I'm saying? Yeah, yeah when opportunity happened. presents itself, you got to take advantage of that shit, bro. You got to be ready. Man. That's what the music shit is about, man. Hell like, yeah. And he could have been on some bullshit. I mean, I don't give a fuck. Like, but that nigga, you know. You see, it. he see, said, it's yeah. a difference when you see somebody working and opposed to somebody in your DM all day. Like, yeah. say, I'm trying to do this or I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's yeah. a difference when you see somebody active and working. So that's why, shit, to any up and coming artists, like, work. Yeah. Even if you, you know what I'm saying? If you feel like you're there, if you feel like you're not there, work. Because somebody going to see you working. Hell yeah. They're going to expect it. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. As long as you put the work in, niggas gonna have no choice but to see it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Everybody damn this nigga, this nigga work. Every time I see, every time I'm on Insta Instagram, I see this nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah you I know see what some saying? music. That's why you gotta stay relevant, dog. A lot of niggas, my advice for niggas, a lot of niggas do music or a lot of niggas do whatever they do, but they ain't advertising what they do. You feel me? They just like putting bullshit on there. Like, nigga, let me know if you do music. Let me go on your page and see that you're doing music. Video, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to go in there and see one picture. Yeah, <laughs> you know like, what I'm saying. That's why I be telling my my, my like, wife, dude, who's like, this? Yo, you got every picture you you got, nigga, you got your uncle on that bitch. Like, cause damn, this a family motherfucker uh, page or it's your music page? What is it, dog? Like, you know what I'm saying? That's why I got my shit separate. I got my personal shit for my, and then I got my podcast. It's shit. 2021. You gotta, you know what I'm saying? Adjust to the times. Oh yeah, for sure. Hell yeah, cause niggas might get tired of seeing your motherfucking kids every day. Like, man, I want to see these kids all the time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I can't see some music and shit. So you just never know, bro. But no, before we tap into the music, dog, off camera, we was talking about how you went to college and shit, and a lot of, I oh, want to yeah. shed light on that, because a lot of niggas be, a lot of niggas be on the show, be like, nigga, we, I said fuck school after high school, or, you know what I'm saying, so, you going to college, dog, give me an experience, like, how was it, man. and at the end of the day, was it worth it, because a lot of niggas be like, man, that college shit was some bullshit, I just owe a lot of money, and I ain't, I ain't get shit from it. You want me to keep it all the way funky 100 with you on this show, man? Man, show me, you got to, bro, you got Take to, bro. I went to college, too, though. Shit, congrats to y'all niggas. I wish I would have got this. I ain't finished that shit. Bro. I ain't had no money. Shout out to my uh, my HBCU man, Kentucky State University. Oh shit, man. I would have definitely got kicked out. Man, <laughs> I see so many people go the first week. School started August 10th. Niggas getting kicked out, <laughs> motherfucking Labor Day. Duh. Niggas was not making it for man. sure. But man, shout out to Kentucky State, man. I learned a lot there, like. I was down there from uh, 2008, 2013. Yeah. And, um, man, I, I grew up down there. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? At the time, when I was, like, finishing high school, I was just at a point, you know what I'm saying, just ready to, like, get out, be on my own and shit. Hell yeah. I'm applying to schools in fucking Daytona Beach, Florida. Yeah. Motherfucking <laughs> Texas. I was, man, y'all remember motherfucking College Hill? Yeah. <laughs> I done applied to every school duh. college hill that went duh. to. <laughs> duh, that's the shit, dog. College hill, boy. Man, I'm trying this. to get on the black college tour, but no. Nah, <laughs> for real, though, that's what kind of led me to uh, Kentucky State, though. It was uh, the closest HBCU that I got accepted to. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Coming out of uh, high school, my grades weren't the best, but they was they were solid. Like yeah. I graduated with a three Yeah, for sure. Man, trying to get into like Eastern. See, that was great for me. Nigga. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it was solid. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It wasn't no three I'll five, three seven. Crazy. But um, <laughs> coming out of uh, like being here, I remember like Eastern Michigan State. They was all trying to get me to uh, get into. They was they weren't really trying to show no love. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had applied to Kentucky State. Um, just random man like i said i had shout out to my nigga uh aaron brown yeah his pops uh rest in peace to his pops uh aaron brown senior mm -hmm. his pops at the initiative to get college applications uh waived yeah for everybody in our senior oh, class shit, hell yeah. we literally made a list of every school we wanted to go to he got yeah. applications mm -hmm. waived you just have to apply apply shit had to pay man, for i'm applying for. to so much <laughs> shit no, I'm, like yeah. i said i'm applying to everywhere on college field <laughs> all the Duh. hbcus i got accepted to so many different schools you yeah. feel me but um 
None of the schools in Michigan was trying to offer me no money. Yeah. Um, I had received like a partial scholarship academics. Like I said, I graduated like a 3.0. I was yeah. hooping and shit, trying to keep my grades up for hooping. Hell yeah. Um, I got an academic scholarship to Bethune Cookman in Daytona Beach, Florida. Okay. Jackson State, Mississippi. Yeah. And then Kentucky State. Okay. I took uh, the Kentucky State one. My people were like, shit, are you about to be getting back and forth from Florida today? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hell yeah, for real. So Kentucky was the closest one, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it was uh, a couple people from my uh, high school that ended up getting accepted there too. So yeah, it was just like, you know what I'm saying? Shit. I rocked with it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I learned a lot down there, man. I grew up, um, like I said, 18 to... Uh, 23, you know what yeah. I'm saying? New years in life, like, Hell yeah. in fucking racist ass Frankfurt, Kentucky. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Duh. All places. Like, it was a different, it, it put me in a different mindset than being back being here. here you know crib, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, one of my crazy experience, I remember when, um, just first being on campus, like, walking to and from, uh, the motherfucking cafeteria day. I remember this one dude, he's always like, man, what's going on? What up, dog? Yeah. Be like, nigga, I don't know you. Like, what the <laughs> fuck is you? Yeah. Why are you talking to me like? Yeah, for sure. One day, you're just like, man, you just, you dress nice, you seem cool, bro. You just seem like a nice dude. Yeah. He's just like, nigga, I'm from Detroit. Like, niggas don't just come yeah. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? You'd be weirded out but if somebody that, just that. came up to see you like, bro, you seem like you yeah. cool as hell. Like, no, that's trying how... to be your friend. Hell like, yeah, what? for sure. But that's how it is in South, though. Yeah, that shit weird. It's kind of Southern. Yeah. But you got people from everywhere. Though. I had people from Kentucky, you know what I'm saying, Chicago, yeah. uh, Atlanta. Like, yeah. it was like a real melting pot type mm -hmm. of shit. It was probably more Detroit people than anybody down there. Yeah, for sure. You know yeah, what yeah. I'm saying? On bullshit. Yeah. Like, yeah, you feel yeah. me? Yeah. So it was just like, you kind of, you know what I'm saying? You kind of knew it was a lot of people from Cleveland. Shout out to my nigga Tay War. That was like one of my main uh, people yeah. down there. Right now, he doing big things with the music shit. Yeah, he was up. one of the first people that I knew. Like, Hell yeah. He was on a football team. You know what I'm saying? We just got cool living in the dorm, smoking weed together and shit. Yeah, yeah. Nigga like, bro, I rap. I'm like, nigga, you rap, let me hear something. <laughs> yeah. Bro, this first song was so motherfucking hard, dog. This was when, like, Lil Wayne dropped yeah. a milli. Yeah. He had, like, made a beat that was, he made the beat. Mm -hmm. It was similar to, like, a milli, like, on some hard shit. He on that bitch going, going nigga. He's going crazy. They got it pumped that bitch all through the campus, nigga. <laughs> got this nigga performing and shit. Like, bro, this shit hard, nigga. What the fuck? Uh. I swear to God. That shit sure. was... Man, that's man, what's up, but though. he been doing that shit for years now, like, man. Yeah. That nigga, <clears throat> before the uh, pandemic and shit, he was, like, on tour with uh, the Two Loud crew. Okay. Not Uncle Luke, but, like, you know what I'm saying, yeah. the rest of them yeah, and shit. Yeah, 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 Man, them niggas came to Detroit, dog. We went to one of them, uh, I can't think of that fucking club out there off 75, like, Allen Park. Shit, don't give me a line. One of them, uh, don't give me a fucking line. I just know about the club downtown. And yeah, shit. like yeah. what about the way, but man, they had the two line crew in there. It used to be Lucky's. Oh shit, for real? You probably know what I'm yeah. talking about too, like yeah. out the way on 75. Mm -hmm. But man, I remember he uh, told me to meet him out there. Yeah. We got there, came in the back door. Two line crew niggas got a like, big gold chain yeah, on. Yeah, Come in, this food. They had his food platters and yeah. shit. What you want to drink? <laughs> what the fuck? Duh. You know what I'm saying? I just Man. drove from Highland Park. Like, shit, yeah. what the fuck going on out here? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We already got strippers and shit in the booth and shit, man. Man. That nigga turned that bitch up with him. He had just one little song with him, one feature. Yeah. Bro, that shit went crazy. Nigga, Duh. I had pulled my phone out. Chick got the dancing on me yeah. and shit. Man. My phone and froze up. Bro. <laughs> it's all, man, that shit was crazy as fuck. That was a wild ass night, Duh. bro. <laughs> Man, no, niggas got loud for real. Man, dog. shout out to my nigga Tay Ward, dog. That's he, he doing it. big things, man. He just dropped a song with Jada Kiss, matter of fact, man. Damn, that's what's up. That's yeah, what's up. Yeah, yeah. Hey, he tell me things, this, though, dog. Man. I want to know this. You went to HBCU, dog. Mm -hmm. That first day on campus, dog. All them black chicks, bro. Like, man, <laughs> my first, my first week on campus, man. I say, every day I leave my dorm, I just like, I came from, I'm coming from the city, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Where. We'd be going to the fireworks and shit, yeah. trying to see how many, you know what I'm yeah, saying? For That's sure. how it was feeling. It was that type of Every vibe. Day. The, I'm going, man, I did. By like the first week, I would probably talk to every chick on campus, like every group, you man. know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, I'm waiting for some new ones to come. I like, can imagine, dog. Man, it was, it was, it was dope as hell, though. Like, <clears throat> just being able to meet people from everywhere. Like, my nigga Tay War, um, 
instead of like sometimes the the campus life was fun but like you first get down there august september yeah homecoming party slapping man after that it's like damn i'm tired of seeing these same yeah, motherfuckers yeah. like living on <laughs> like living at a high school yeah, you know what i'm saying yeah, type shit sure. you seeing the same motherfuckers and shit so you start going home and shit I'm riding back to Cleveland, my Cleveland people. Yeah. I'm riding to Indianapolis yeah, instead yeah. of coming home to Detroit, though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Getting the the different type of vibes and everywhere is just so different. Hell yeah, no, it's different. Hell, when you go other places outside of the city, you be like, I ain't no where like Detroit, man. man. Hell no, ain't when you go somewhere, you be looking shit. like damn that shit. Everything different, bro. When I was in Texas. I remember my brother, his wife from Louisiana, like we in New Orleans for his wedding. You stand I'm out in, like a short thumb. I'm in Philly, like dog. <laughs> Philly was the closest thing to Detroit, bro. Like, wouldn't you say that shit? Like Baltimore. But yeah, when I was in Philly, that was the closest thing to me. Even though houses like side by side, so you got roaches, they got roaches, nigga. Like, mm -hmm. and bitches right there, then you right, but you know what I'm saying. But like everywhere else, like Cali, like you be in the most thuggest, hoodest area, dog. Everybody sound proper as hell. Like, mm -hmm. damn, this this the, this the hood. Like, and they hood look good. You got palm trees in this bitch, like. So, <laughs> like, fish. I was in Kentucky, though. Look good as hell. <laughs> My first year, uh, that's when Obama won. Yeah. That's when we got our first black president. Okay. I'm in the reddest of red states. Dog, oh, hell yes. Man. Talking about to hang your ass just because you won. Man, I'm talking about, man, it was crazy down there. Just that culture, like. We yeah, no, shout out to wild. Detroit Police they, they Department because, yes. man, Detroit Police Department. I want to know. They they it's rough here in Detroit. You yeah. feel me? They don't harass us the way that I was getting harassed down there yes, by the fucking sheriffs, by the state troopers, by the fucking man. city police. Like the city wasn't that big. Yeah, I got all these. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I could have. We could be, have some shit like this going on. You got a sheriff knocking at your door like, yeah, yeah uh, what the fuck going on? such and such across the street said that uh, a bunch of people over here, but I used to have wild shit uh, happen. Like, I remember um, I was chilling, watching the basketball game. I had a couple people over to like, we chilling, dog. Yeah. Get a knock at the door. I'm thinking there's somebody coming in. My roommate going to answer. Yeah. Fucking sheriff walking in like, yeah, this was a young... Uh, White girl, she went missing with a uh, black male. The oh, like coming right to your door with that oh, shit, bro. Wow. Man. For real. Man, wow. And then the fuck around to leave a ticket and shit. Like, oh, you smoking weed in here too? Yeah. <laughs> Duh. That shit was different, yeah. bro. No, you got be like, in those areas like that, you talking about that shit. Like, like for real, like, Detroit, they let you live, bro. They, 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 they don't harass you, like. Looking for Cynthia and shit, yeah. bro. <laughs> Man, yeah, I'm missing white girl, Then when they got man. every motherfucking nigga in the city they could find, like, dog, that shit wild. Cause like, dog, we talking about that shit. I was talking about that shit with somebody, bro. When I was driving from Texas to uh, back to Detroit, real. bro, you going through these old hick towns, nigga, and you got dog. These ain't no regular looking white people, bro. Like these, look, they look like some hanging ass white niggas. Like they gonna kill you, and you ain't gonna be nowhere to be found, bro. In these little small ass towns, like you say, they will kill your ass, and you would be Louisville, gone. Louisville, you know what I'm saying? It's a man, lot of, it's a lot of black people in Louisville. <laughs> Lexington, that's a college town. When yeah. I was down there, University of Kentucky was going crazy. Yeah. So I used to bump into uh, all the players. They treat it ain't no professional teams in Kentucky. Yeah, it's okay, yeah, Kentucky. Just so they that, treat they basketball teams like NBA players. Yeah. I used to bump into Anthony Davis, John yeah. Wall, yeah. Gil, uh, Marcus Hill, Gig, uh, Kill Gilkers, yeah. uh, Demarcus Cousins, because yeah. I'm at the Black College. Yeah, you feel me? Hell so yeah. we just. Man. Man, hell yeah. I already know. You already know. But you go you go a little further out. You go outside of them towns, you know what I'm saying? Like, man. I was just tripping off the white girl. <laughs> man, that shit was crazy, no, bro. Hey, that bitch like, hey, y'all. Like, fuck this. I ain't even going out. I'm about to go home. No. Just drive to Detroit. I was just transferring like a motherfucker. I hit some niggas. Four years, bro. Man. Okay. I stayed out there five years. Five years? So, man. Yeah, just, my last day, I swear to God, the day I graduated, I packed up my little Impala, whatever I could fit in that yeah, bitch, I left my that motherfucking bitch. door open with the key in that bitch, <laughs> nigga. No. Fresh from graduation, I smoked all the little weed up I had. I was gone. <laughs> Hell no, I, I was out there. Hey man, bitch. but shit, you graduated though, bro. A lot of niggas can't say they, yeah, they did that oh, shit. Oh yeah, man. No, so I, I ain't graduating, dog. That's something I wish I, I tried. I, though. Yeah, I tried too, nigga. But see, I had baby on the way of money, and like, damn, this shit ain't serious for me. Like, I gotta get out of here. Yeah. But that's one thing I, I I regret, bro. I ain't get to live that college life, that dorm life. You know what I'm saying? Like that's that shit, shit was different, man. I see a lot of niggas get beat up. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of niggas get beat up in them doors, no, man. Oh, you were you were you driving, brother? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> like, let me go ahead and go, go to school. <laughs> hey, nigga, school. Blow this hell. <laughs> Yeah, but like, you that bitch, yeah, when you go to WC3, you in that bitch with niggas who 40. Bro, you in that bitch with niggas' mamas. Like, that I'm in school with your daughter. <laughs> <laughs> I remember you used to drop her off. No, that shit crazy. You all in that bitch now, dog. Bro, you got it, bro. You, you realize, like, a motherfucker can be dumb, young or old. You can be like, <laughs> this like 50, dumb as hell. Oh, yeah, everybody be idiots. <laughs> Man, that's one lesson that, that you learn growing <laughs> up. The older you get, you realize that everybody be fucking idiots. No, for real. But nigga, then I see how my what my parents are talking about, bro. When he's trying to help me with my homework, though, like this is a new shit. I'll be glad to have my son smart as hell, though. Like you know this shit, you show sure? bet. I'll be happy to have a nigga at three point something. Like all right, bet I ain't gotta help this nigga, dog. Cause then, as soon as he fuck up, I'm saying nigga to my to his older cousin, dog. Like cause I ain't gonna know shit. Like man, you gotta break down how to do two times two, nigga. Like they gotta show work for everything. They remember back then you just had to show work for algebra or some shit. Like nigga, you gotta show work for times tables. Like nigga, what? This shit completely different, like nigga. This yeah, shit weird. Yeah, dog. I hated that shit. Like these niggas don't even do spell tests no more. These little niggas, dog. They just, I don't. They don't do cursive, nigga. Like none of that shit we had to do, bro. Shit, I had to learn cursive. <laughs> yeah, like how you? The only time you use that bitch for a cursive, signature. Man. What, seventh grade, Miss Brown? <laughs> yeah, yeah. She was on niggas' ass at Liberty. Bro. Oh yeah, man. Cursive, bro. <laughs> man. Right, everything cursive, bro. I hate hey, that shit. Y'all to hear a funny ass story about <laughs> Liberty? What up? Man, so Liberty seventh grade in Highland Park, they made everybody. Uh, Highland Park got four uh schools. Yeah, Cortland, yeah. Barber, Liberty, and Ford. Okay, so they was all K through eight type shit. Yeah, yeah our slamming. seventh grade year, they decided they want to send all the middle schoolers seventh and eighth grade to Liberty. Yeah, man, that shit was so motherfucking wild in that big <laughs> dog. No. That bitch was tight. That bitch was tight. <laughs> You had everybody from Highland Park in your age group. Yeah, right, right there. there. No. Hell yeah, it's just time. Man, I got into a fight with the biggest nigga my second day at the school. Like first, my first day. <laughs> like the first, <laughs> like the first in the beginning. Uh, my mom had sent me to Oak Park and shit. Yeah. She tried to make me go to school out there, but that shit just ain't work out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so she let me uh, go back to Liberty and shit. Man, my second day at this bitch. I done got into it with this, man, rest in peace, my nigga Heavy, man, yeah. motherfucker, uh, Marcel Dubois, man, he motherfucking HP legend, yeah. real HP legend, niggas gonna laugh at this shit, cause they know this shit, dog, <laughs> but, uh, man, we, uh, they like, once you eat at lunch and shit, you go outside and hoop, yeah. I'm the hooping ass nigga, I'm like, bet, you yeah, know, yeah, just yeah. gobble my shit, dog, I'm about to, nigga, <laughs> just a gobble, so yeah, shit, <laughs> quick as hell, <laughs> So shit, we out there and shit. I remember seeing heavy out there with the ball and shit. So I'm like, shit, we about to shoot up uh, teams and shit. He's like, no, we about to play 21. <laughs> so I'm like, no, bro, it's early. We to play teams. <laughs> That nigga blew my shit up. <laughs> bro, that nigga punched me hard as I ever got hit in my <laughs> fucking life, bro. I swear to God. No no games, no talking, no. Boom. <laughs> like, yeah, Tyson, nigga, like, boom, nigga. I'm, what the fuck? <laughs> Looking around and shit. I know they, I know you got hit hard when you start looking. Nigga. What the fuck, niggas are circling around quick as hell and shit, big ass circle. Dumb, I'm looking, I'm looking for my niggas and shit. Like damn, you know what I'm saying? I got my niggas from where I grew up in barber and shit. They like niggas, you on your own. Like, What's up, nigga? <laughs> I remember all his niggas just came out of nowhere like, no, it's a one on one, it's a one on one. I'm like, one on one? This nigga, about a hundred pounds. This nigga about a good one eighty. No. All just like, no. duh. I like the as fuck. Hell for a yeah, we got <laughs> cocky as hell, oh, bro. We got to throw them bitches, dog. I'm fighting for my life, nigga. <laughs> Every fucking punch, nigga. I'm over here trying to put precision on them bitches. <laughs> Man, what? Mm. We thought of it, <laughs> dog. Oh my so look, so look. After that, nigga. Oh, I remember that shit. Man. After that, <laughs> nigga. All the girls just sit over there with me and shit like, yeah. I was like, what the you, fuck? You won for real? You did good. Like, you did good. Like, like, you did good. Shit, I'm over here what? just trying to, I'm trying to get my thoughts together, dog. I swear to God. <laughs> I'm trying to get my shit together, like, man. Oh, the fuck? This nigga came back over there like, nigga, you won? Nigga, we get to throw them bitches again. 
I'm like, oh shit, <laughs> nigga, I'm, nigga, I got this nigga in the headlock, this nigga got me all up in the air like this and shit, yeah. duh, this shit crazy, nigga, uh, yeah. this nigga is big, it's like a UFC fighter, nigga, like, a heavyweight, I'm super, well, super lightweight, nigga, like, I'm like, fighting for Floyd, like, like, Floyd, like Floyd versus Tyson, duh. nigga, for real, dog. Yo, yeah, yo, yeah. I'm, I'm a fucking sweat, oh, nigga, duh. Yeah. 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 Fuck these niggas fighting over, dog. Duh. This, <laughs> shit, this shit was so wild, nigga. <laughs> the gym teacher, Mr. Ball, was over the motherfucking oh, uh, lunch shit. period. Yeah, I done went over to him like, man, me and Marcel just fought. You know what I'm saying? You can suspend us. You call our mamas, do what you got to do. He's like, y'all boys, y'all be all right. Duh. That nigga came back over again. I had to fight a third round, dog. Duh. Nigga Three bad. times, you dog. Nigga. Three times in like 30 minutes. Duh, damn. Dog, dog. what? Oh, Outside, shit. hot ass day. God. It's August. You feel me? Dog, like, that man. shit funny as The hell. biggest nigga in the school, dog. That nigga say two days in, dog. <laughs> that nigga <laughs> blew your shit out, nigga. Boom, we playing 21, nigga. I ain't know if I wanted to play 21 <laughs> teams. I could remember sit up. <laughs> Boom, what the fuck? Dog, damn, dog. Yeah. This nigga got me high as hell. Man. Shit, dog. That's a funny classic yeah. shit, dog. Classic, classic ass HP good. story, hey, man. I definitely got to put that shit on the IG, bro. Like, classic yeah, ass HP story, I, man. I saw my first titty in the HP uh, Liberty fight. No. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. You know, you used to be waiting to see a titty bump out. That was that shit. I'll hey. never forget it. Hey, let me get wild as hell, bro. Crack it. I love this school. <laughs> <laughs> My love. man that fought this big ass... Mike Tyson nigga I see some titties in this bitch and dog you right though whenever a chick fight dog a titty gonna come out dog nigga you looking for the titties bro you yeah, be mad as hell that bitch don't come out grade, dog. like nigga where the titties at <laughs> god oh, damn bro yeah, that, that shit, shit was wild rest, shit, in peace, that's, my, rest in peace one nigga heavy though cr- man me and him end up being good friends after that dog damn, man like damn yeah rest in peace that ain't lying though cause I came back to Liberty that same year and nigga I seen the wildest shit nigga we was our second period, we had a motherfucking math teacher. This bitch had to be like 77. Oh, <laughs> I'm talking about frail. Old as fuck, nigga. I'll never forget it, nigga. She was getting on somebody's nerves, nigga. She turned around to write some shit on the chalkboard, dog. Like five kids, bro. Had a handful of BBs, and they just was bombing. Dog. dog. They was bombing, and she just, oh, this <laughs> <laughs> damn. Yeah, bomb, bomb, dog. I'm like, whoa, what is this? Why niggas this house been running? Hey, but why niggas just be happy about school like that? Niggas be hype for school like that. No, it wasn't wild. no social media. It wasn't no phones. Bro. It wasn't none yeah. of that bro, shit. I swear to God, that was bro. the interaction you used to look oh, at. After, after that, she passed the whole class yeah. for the rest of the year. I'll never forget that Hold shit. Hold on, dog. So, uh, real quick, I'm giving y'all, y'all okay, off of me. I don't like this shit be about me, but nigga, in sixth grade, I had my home road teacher name was Mr. Williams. Mm-hmm. Mr. Williams, I don't know if y'all ever met a nigga dog who yeah. earned be like this and shit. Got a chicken wing. <laughs> yeah, for so, sure. nigga, he walking smooth as nigga, always wearing a, like leather outfits. Nigga. Gotta be smooth. No. <laughs> <laughs> so, nigga, be crispy. nigga, one time, nigga, I'm in that bitch, dog. I come in, we, so um, me and my man get into it, dog. We get into it. Oh, so, oh so this nigga unloosed that chicken wing, bro. When I say he grabbed me, nigga, that was the strongest grab, nigga. Like, that motherfucker was like <laughs> bite scripts, nigga. Like, nigga, <laughs> like, nigga. <laughs> Like, damn, let me go, Mr. Williams. That nigga. That nigga learned <laughs> <laughs> from that day. That nigga had that chicken wing. Never like, fuck with a like, chicken wing. Nigga, y'all don't fuck around in this classroom. Nigga had that chicken wing. That bitch, just like this, nigga. Chicken wing, nigga. Other earned straight, nigga. He had that bitch. He hand you up with the nigga, chicken wing. Nigga, he gripped me, nigga. And then he probably scared you because how the hand was looking. No, it was. <laughs> and that bitch was that close. You like, man, stop playing, bro. Fucking fingers on the west side, nigga. That bitch was gripping. You didn't know what to do, dog. Because when you a little nigga, you see something like that, you scared of handicapped people, dog. That nigga. Shout hey, out to bro, Mr. Williams, I, bro. I, had a, I had a nigga who fought a handicapped nigga before. Oh, nigga, I know a nigga who fought with him before. I never tell who it was. That's like that one. That's like the nigga dog who be who be hooping with that one arm. Nigga, I be mad as hell. Nigga, dunk on me, y'all. But that nigga sweet as fuck. That nigga, nigga get punch you with that bitch, coming bro. around. Dog. Oh, a nub. A nigga punch you with a nub, bro. That's the hell of a hit, bro. That's all bar. I remember back in <laughs> class. I remember <laughs> back in <laughs> class. Bro, I seen it happen, Dog. bro. I'm like, damn. Dog, that shit funny he as hell, bro. Nub, bro. God bro. damn. I wasn't expecting to be laughing like that, yeah, though. <laughs> nah, nigga, on the music tip, bro. Man. You know what I'm saying? You, let's get to music shit real quick, dog. Sure. With your ass, like you said, you started just a year, a year and a half ago, and shit, being serious with the shit. Yeah, I man, January so, for real, January 2020. Man. Before I even knew the pandemic was gonna happen, like 
<clears throat> and so you started the pandemic with your music. You came in business just <laughs> put a fucking virus in this motherfucker with the music, with the heat, nigga. <laughs> like, I'll tell you when I first hear, I ain't gonna lie to you, nigga. I ain't gonna lie to you, nigga. Right hand to God. First time I heard about your music, bro. <laughs> first time I heard about this music, you know, you know where? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. On Kid L shit, bro. Oh yeah, <laughs> for sure. Uh, on Kid L shit. <laughs> so hold on, let me say. So uh, yeah. I got him. I got him. Kid, Kid L. Shout out to Kid L. He was on. He was on the show and shit, bro. So nigga, I got hip to him because he uh he had this my man's and shit, bro. My, I'm like dunk. My man's had reposted because he ain't no real rapper for real. So I'm like, then who was this fucking nigga who was just uh uh di- going in on nigga shit? So nigga, I started being in tune to this shit. So I see what he did to you. So he, he he dissed your song and shit, but tell me, dog, what what the fuck made you send so in a this diss song to this nigga, dog? Ten six shit, dog. man. Talk about this shit, dog. I remember that shit, man. So look, man, I was around for some crazy shit. Man, that shit was just a year ago, dog. Yeah. Life happened so fast. So, like I said, I just started rapping January. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? 2020. Yeah. Um, shout out to my nigga Cam You know what I'm saying I, I started fucking with him Like we go, I'm going to his career Recording yeah. my first couple songs And shit oh, So shit. Um, shit Pandemic <laughs> happened All that shit happened Fast forward yeah. Shit I'm shooting You know what I'm saying I did my first video Yeah 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 I'm excited and shit You feel me Yeah So I remember I'm telling all my people Like you know what I'm saying Uh Shit, I got uh, the day it dropped. I yeah. did the review with Kid L. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My nigga Cam did a review with Kid L. That nigga Kid L showed him some love. Yeah, like, all right, this yeah. is straight. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. You, you know what I'm saying? I see what she did. He showed him love and shit. So I'm like, all right. That's how I found out about Kid L. Yeah, so I'm like, nigga. shit. All right, he showed my nigga Cam some love. I'm gonna reach out to him and keep it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, keep like it. Like that and shit. Yeah. So um, <laughs> I'm motherfucking fucking uh, send a song to Kid L and shit. I remember I'm chilling. I got uh, one of my niggas at the crib with me about to leave and shit. I'm like, hold on, bro. My uh, review drop. He's about to drop in like uh, about, about 30 minutes. He just hit me up and shit. So he like, all right, we sitting smoking. You know what I'm saying? Turn it up. Shit. Uh, oh, that's like that. Bro, that nigga <laughs> dropped that bitch. That nigga on that bitch hamming me like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> like, dog, like really dragging me, though. Like, <laughs> I felt like the shit. I felt like the shit got disrespectful at some point because it was just like the nigga was going on my shit long, like for a whole <laughs> five <laughs> minutes. A little too long. He <laughs> opened up the show with my shit. Like, what the fuck is this? Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you really went to the studio. You really called macros. You really went and got the video, man. You really did. Like, he yeah. dragging my yeah. shit. Like, I'm he, I'm <laughs> you, man. You, you know, tell everybody about the review and shit. Well, I'm sitting there with my man. He looking at me like, what you gonna do? <laughs> What the fuck? Who is this nigga? Like, <laughs> niggas was niggas was ready to go at this nigga. Like, niggas was ready to beat him up. Niggas was ready to do all type of shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm from HP, nigga. <laughs> what the fuck? The fuck? You know what I'm saying? Like, man. But that whole night, I was heated, man. I remember my homegirl came over, smoking weed and shit. She fell asleep, woke up. I'm up writing that shit. I didn't... I'm so motherfucking mad. I would probably just turned on angry, you know, YouTube and watch the first thing I see. Duh. Like, Duh, funny like man. man, fuck this nigga, man. Yeah. Like, but. What's, man, that was one of my first. Uh, that was granddad shit, dog. Oh, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, nigga, who coming downstairs? It's yeah. all good, granddad. Just the sheriff looking for the white girl. <laughs> <laughs> Got memories and shit, dog. Man. So, nigga, hold on. So, so you send it, you send the first song again. You hype I and shit. I send it in. I'm oh. hype. Um, yeah. You know what I'm saying? This is my first song. Um, I got it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I went through True Love Productions. He was doing big things. Uh, shout out True Love Productions. You know what I'm saying? He's shooting for Rocky Bad at the time yeah. and shit. You know what I'm saying? I uh, got Tiny Jag to be in the video. Yeah, I'm yeah. not sure if y'all hit to uh, Tiny Jag. No, yes. I ain't hip. I ain't hip. Man, I'll have to check her out. She a dope artist. She um, part of the Symbol Sound team right now. Okay. She's going crazy, man. Her visuals, her songs and everything is like... like check her out. Yeah, it's, it's next <clears throat> level for sure. But yeah. I got Tiny Jag in the video. I'm feeling good. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Like, Hell yeah. downtown and everything. Going crazy. Man, this nigga done hold. Like, just shot down all so, my mom. Uh, let me, let me ask you this, though. Everything. Was you mad the fact that he was, like, critiquing your shit? Or you was mad that he was going hard? Like, if it he... wasn't really a critique. It wasn't a... Uh, <laughs> oh, you could have did this better. You could have, you know what I'm so saying. So would you, if you would say that, would you would have been cool with that? If you would have did that, like that, that, that way instead of just going like in, the first, like really the first minute really and a half, it was like, it was like, all right, 
But that second <laughs> two, <laughs> three, I think like you done kept going for like two, three, four, five minutes. And then at this point, it's like you're trying to ham me. You're trying to little boy yeah. me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this shit yeah, was yeah. like, all right. Because I, cause I, a lot of times, I, I, ain't gonna, I ain't say this to him and, and before he was on the show. I'm like, if you send in your music, be uh, be um expect for you know saying it can go good or bad. But yeah. I see what you talking about. Like you saying like scared to send some shit to that. So, yeah. so you so you was like nigga, you were like you you cool with it, but it was just how he went in on your shit, huh? Man, it was like it was so unexpected. It caught me so off guard. <laughs> like I was so like like I said, that was my first video. Yeah. This is the first thing that I so did. This is really your motherfucking. Invested. This is like your first kid. This is my nigga. baby. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And you didn't like nigga. You didn't wasted your time and went yeah. in the motherfucking studio, <laughs> recorded this shit, Duh. got a cameraman, paid for this yeah. shit. Wasted what the his fuck? Time. Like, what the fuck is this? Duh. Like, yeah, that's how his voice was too. Yeah, like he was tripping. So tell me this, dog. Like, <laughs> like what what was the process of you sending sending a diss on to him? Did you have this in the motherfucking title? I fucking <laughs> sent that shit probably the next week trying to put that bitch on the next episode. Yeah, make sure you can redeem yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like I was heated, like Yeah. That shit was more. Man, how long it take? How long did it take for you to get for him to get the diss on? Like, like, and what? Like, like you could tell when you watched the episode where I dissed him and shit. You could tell he was kind of thrown off. He ain't have shit to say. He was just yeah. like, yeah. he called me fat. He like you fucking fat. <laughs> <laughs> he was like he was just. No, you could tell because he wasn't expecting it. Because uh, uh, um, Deshaun had showed me the original clip. Because the only thing I I caught the the actual diss. Mm-hmm. I never thought I never caught when he was like critiquing your first shit. I just caught the diss part. So when he did that shit, he was like, "Huh, is he dissing me?" Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> like so that's what that's what Deshaun. When told I sent me. the song to him, it just said, "It just said, I just sent the audio, and it just said, Fuck Kid L.'" Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Then, and then, so so he, that whole day it was just like. I hit him up like, shit, when you gonna drop this shit? And he just DM me back, fuck you. So I take like the DM and post that shit like, yeah. kid, he'll come and sue. You know what I'm saying? Using all his shit against him. Like, I was, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I was having fun on yeah. Instagram and shit, but it's all funny games, man. I ain't got no problems with kid, yo. Shout out to motherfucking oh, kid, yo. Kid, cool. He a cool nigga, though. He cool. He, he chopping up with me and shit. The funniest... Need- I don't even know Kid L, dude. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I, I want to put that out there because a lot of people be like trying to jump into beef and you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, all type just, of weird yeah, type you of... you just came back at them. Like, bro, this is some silly ass music shit. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And I'm going to keep it there. And I, yeah, yeah. Now, the funniest shit though, <laughs> the funniest shit with me, because um, like I said, I, I, the nigga shit is amusing. It's funny as hell, dog. Like, I, I fuck with it. But it was one episode, dog, when a nigga sent in a, a song of an old T.I., uh, a mixtape uh, cover <laughs> So he reviewing A T.I. song Like This sounds so updated Like he was going in on it So I inbox uh, My man's like dog I inbox him Like nigga you know It's a T.I. That's T.I. dog Like Somebody done sent this nigga A T.I. song bro <laughs> Like bro, Fucking 2005 Nigga like The mixtape days When it was heavy bro I'm like hold on I wonder do he know That he, was, he reviewing A T.I. song right now <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm like, and who the fuck sent the T.I. song in? Like, it's what yeah. I want to know, dog. But no, it's, it, it's just amusing, bro. But like, it's just funny because like, that's the first time I peeped your shit. And then... I got that shit, that, at that time, that was his most viewed video. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? That so was his like, most damn, viewed shit. Not only shit. did you fucking diss me, nigga. You talking about the diss song was the most viewed? Yeah, oh, the okay, diss okay. song was his okay. most viewed shit yeah. at the time. So I had a... It, it, you know what I'm saying? It definitely like, I ain't gonna lie. gave me I like in, a little buzz I was in the comments like, why is nigga sending this song? What's the point of that? But I, I, I didn't know a backstory. Mm-hmm. So then when... But I didn't want to like... It was a bunch of... I had niggas offering to shoot videos for free. Yeah, People just was for that shit. Yeah, niggas man. was trying to... Because, uh, man, it was, he'd be hoeing a lot of people. Yeah. So there's a lot of people yeah. coming to me like, bro, yeah. you... Man, thank you for doing that shit. Like it was yeah. a lot of people Duh. reaching out to me. Like, that bro, I funny, feel bro. you. Like, man, <laughs> hey, bro, nigga, you know what I'm that saying? That nigga whole little intro on there, funny as hell, because it be all niggas threatening him. Yeah, hell yeah. I'ma fuck now, you up. Nigga. Now I don't all think it, should, like it shouldn't go that far, bro. Because at the end of the day, he just doing his thing. Like, yeah, bro, I ain't about to, I ain't about being the guy. So he ain't, he ain't hurt nobody. He ain't harm nobody. You should never let nobody get your feelings to the point where you know what I'm saying. It's just like that. And then, and then, fast forward. I seen your your shit. You got love on on, on this review <laughs> for uh, uh B, DJ BJ. Oh yeah, yeah. Cause you yeah. you was on the Monday review and shit. Oh yeah, I didn't did. Shout out to DJ for, BJ uh, for, man for Rockstar and shit, dog. BJ been a real nigga even before uh before I started rapping and shit. You know what I'm saying? Me yeah. and him when he got his uh 
his uh shop at Greenfield Plaza. Okay, yeah, Me yeah. And had a little uh, business venture together at the sure. uh, time. Hell BJ yeah. BJ always been solid, always been a real nigga. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? But nah, like, uh, BJ showed me love in uh, T two times. I see you had her oh, yeah, on yeah, here. Yeah, that's a homie. Yeah, she was, uh, I think I was one of the first people to get reviewed when she started doing her music yeah, reviews. Hell yeah. T two times. Saying? She cool as hell, dog. And I, I just yeah, she inboxed her like. I seen her doing shit and I'm like, dog, why don't you uh shit come on the show and talk shit? You know what I'm saying? So she came on so yeah, shout out to T dog. She a uh, cool ass chick, dog. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So uh dog, the project uh you just dropped in uh, February, dog. Just be great. Just be great. I, I I do top fives on niggas on niggas shit, dog, when I listen just to it. So I'm gonna give you my top five and you give me yours and why and shit. So my shit on yours is uh Be Safe, Be Great, uh Rockstar, Sunshine. Uh, Rio and HP in hundred years. Give That's me a good five. That's a good five. Hell yeah! Give me your, give me your, give me your top. Off of my song, off of my shit. Yeah. Uh, man, all them songs like my baby. You got nigga all them bitches, I got, nigga. I got, <laughs> I got stories behind all of them for real, but man, um, <clears throat> rock star. Yeah. One day I was just literally on you know, like listening to beats and shit. That's my favorite. I heard that shit, yeah, that shit and that shit just came to me like I was just feeling myself that day. Yeah. I'm a motherfucking rock star. Yeah, like yeah. I wrote that whole shit out, hook, verse, yeah. hook, and um, shit. It was a song like I had sat on for a long time. Like that was one of the first, you know what I'm saying? One yeah. of my first first songs. It's just like okay, yeah, like yeah, I, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I could do this, but I didn't really. Like I said I was new to this shit. I didn't really know how to market. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the proper for sure. way. Hell but yeah. I knew I wanted to put it on my first project and shit. Yeah. That's a baby. Um, shit, what was your second one you said? Uh, shit, I had uh, that. I had that Be Safe, Be Great, the first shit. Oh, yeah, Be bitch. Safe, Be uh, Great. Shout out to my nigga Twin DZ, man. Me and Twin DZ got the... Uh, and Trice got the Three Ninjas project together. Yeah, I was gonna talk about that shit after this yeah, one. Yeah, we yeah. got the project together. DZ had sent me that beat or whatever originally. <clears throat> I was supposed to just kind of feature on it. Yeah, man, I heard that bitch, listened to it. I got to shred that bitch. He like, go yeah. ahead, bro. You, yeah. just, I'm yeah. like, thank you. Like, yeah. you know what I'm we had put my second it, verse bro. on that bitch, and yeah. this was like, um, you know, what I'm I got a lot of songs. I probably got like, uh, man, close to somewhere between like eighty and a hundred songs recorded. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, ready and shit in the tub. Mm hmm. Hell yeah. But I was just uh really narrowing it down so yeah. that was like one of the last things i recorded before the album okay. it just kind of you know what i'm saying it flowed with it's just like that'll be yeah, a good no, intro that'll hard. pop it yeah, off that'll be jump a, off it. yeah so everything worked good with that so that i feel like that song shows where i was at at the time with the music you yeah. know what i'm saying it wasn't like an old song it was just like yeah, yeah. what this yeah, i can see come. like dog low-key like I, I i you know of course when i have somebody on show i go back listen to their earlier shit to new shit you can see the progression and shit like yeah you see, like you, i say you i'm a new artist a lot of shit. people they don't feel comfortable putting out their early shit you know yeah. what i'm saying like and i was from a person who was a fan of music first, yeah. I decided that I want to give people that early, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because somebody might fuck with my early shit. Yeah, for sure. Hell I think yeah. about like with the Doughboys when they dropped that volume one and volume yeah. two, like, you Hell know what yeah. I'm saying? That they had some classics on that bitch. And hold even... on, dog. Hold on, real quick. You said shit. We were talking about PZ and them, dog. Uh, shout out to uh, my nigga. I, know, um, I think, I forgot their podcast, man. I ain't going to even fuck their shit up. Who would you have to pick, dog, between Team Eastside and Doughboys? Um, team Eastside. Team, I, know, I, I don't want to pick, but Team Eastside. Team Eastside. Damn, I'm the only one. I, I, I was the only one in that bitch. Saying I Dope like Boys. the they Doughboys got, was got pioneers, got pioneers about, though. Dude. Everybody from they click. Dame died and became the all-star. Yeah, yeah, no, no, on that shit. Individual, every, every individual, don't do that. Yeah, because Doughboys, you only got payroll. Went yeah. solo and went hard. Dame. Yeah. Babyface, right? But if we PG. just, if we, yeah, I don't know, if we just talking about that group yeah. shit. Just the, but just the group shit though. Just I the group shit alone. Yeah. Just the group I, I, I vouch for Doughboys because, like I said, I was in Kentucky, so nah, I was on. Like the, I was. It was the same time. Argument, I was going. Yeah. I'm in the same age bracket. I'm going through the same shit. But you know what I'm saying? They talk about their trips to Kentucky. Yeah. Thank God the bag came, man. Every time, man. Every time I came on study five, everybody yeah. follows me to car with my grandma getting dropped off to the. <laughs> Thank God the back, you know what I'm saying? Like, I used to feel that shit coming off the yeah, road. Yeah, you know what I'm sure. saying? Coming off 75 and shit. And then they, uh, when they started doing their little tours and shit, when they yeah. used to come down there, I remember all the, they had a show in Lexington. 
All the Detroit people at the school, we went and bought out all the VIP at the uh, at the club before they got there. Yeah. So when they got there, they had to come in there and fuck with us and shit. Hell yeah, for you sure. You know what I'm saying? And it was just like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it was, it was, wild. yeah. <laughs> that was it was good. Uh, that shit was like Detroit though, where it'd be like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that Kentucky shit, country. Hell yeah, for sure. Hell yeah. <laughs> so she, yeah. So, so but you, the, I, I, I got to see them firsthand. Like, you know what I'm saying? Coming down there, my first year. Leaving Kentucky, um, one of my homeboys who was there, he ended up being like the student government president. Yeah. And I vouched for them to, you know what I'm saying, get put on the homecoming card. Okay. That shit happened. That shit was crazy. Like, Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? No, like, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, and I said, I had wasn't one there. He was talking about some shit. That nigga funny as hell. Uh, Dre on that bitch, dog. Like, shit. I just watched that. Yeah, that shit just funny as hell, dog. Yeah. Yeah. Them niggas really, was definitely. Dre a real nigga, They man. definitely burst like South a sound, dog, for sure. Up. So see, you say you we, we talk about your solo project and shit, dog. You didn't give me your top five, but it's cool. <laughs> but but, yeah. uh, the, it's like I said, they all my. No, you say all, yeah, that's your first shit. So you like all them bitches. You can't, you know what I'm saying? I feel like a song a lot of people sleep on is a uh, ball on list with Big Keys. Yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Man. Cause you got you got Keys on that bitch. Hey, who's a, who's nigga again? You got on the uh, HP Hundred Years? Ice Dolo. Yeah, Shout that's to my homie. Yeah, Ice that's Dolo, your heart. Hell yeah, dog. So. Now, Three Ninjas, dog, is you, motherfucker Trice, and uh, Deezy, right? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. So, what, what, what uh, shit, Trice, dog, what made you want to uh, do this shit, bro? Fuck with we'll fuck with, the, with, the, with these two niggas, man. Um, On some project shit. Like, shit, it just happened. Yeah. Like, I was fucking with Deezy. We yeah. was going hard, making shit together. And then, bro, came around. And then, what really, what really happened was shit, we had a motherfucking song. We recorded a song, and we, then we did the... Uh, we recorded the song and shit. Yeah. Then we did the video for it, Off My Mind. Yeah. And then the same day that the video dropped, we just saw Trice and DJ was in the uh, studio. So he had hit me up like, shit, make it up here, you know what I'm saying? Pull up. Came up there. It was about 15 minutes left in the session and shit. He yeah. like, shit, you got something for me? You can put something on the end of this bitch? Yeah. I can't be that bitch. Snap it. Straight in the beach. Swear to God. I can't. <laughs> on the song 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Well, I was really like. That was off my mind. No, off my mind had just dropped. The video had dropped oh, that okay. day. Yeah. We was shooting. Uh, we was recording sixteen and booty talk. A hey, booty call, yeah. Yeah, booty oh, yeah, call. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> I be high as hell. Yeah, I remember that shit. <laughs> I did it yesterday. He was recording. He was recording that shit. <laughs> Niggas, yeah. I fucked up right now. Yeah, sixteen, my shit. I fucked that bitch up, bro. Yeah, yeah. but I came with that bitch snapping though. And, uh, shit. Afterwards, I'm like, shit. Before we uh, just release some singles, we could do one more song. We could call it like Three Ninjas or some shit. Yeah, it's three crap, of us, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Oh, we got three songs together. So we did that. We ended up throwing um, a single on there a piece. Yeah. Then, you know what I'm saying? I, just me and Creative came up a look. Just thinking about that shit for so long. Hell yeah. Came up with the Three Ninjas thing. Y'all, y'all can come out with a part two? Shit. Probably shit. Yeah, it's right now, nigga. It's weird, nigga. It's whatever. Shit, yeah. we can for sure. Hell yeah. Nigga, now, is, is it, but y'all both some solo artists, dog. Is it easier like being... On some double shit or just working with a team, cause then you just gotta worry about one verse, one nigga could write a hook or some shit like what's what's easier, dog? It's I, it's pros and cons. I, I feel like you gotta know the right song to put a nigga on. If you yeah. put a nigga on the wrong song, he ain't gonna get the shine he supposed no, to get. Yeah, fuck the vibe up. Yeah, so it's like you gotta strategize and know who's supposed to be where. Yeah. And who's supposed to be on what. And you know what I'm saying? And you you once y'all figure that out and everybody figure out where they at. And then everybody mesh in on certain parts and shit. That shit sound good and shit. For, yeah. for so that, me, that's the hardest part to me. I yeah. feel like for me working solo, um, <clears throat> shit, it have its challenges. Cause when it's just me, it's like, man, I'm trying to do the absolute best. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's yeah, like sometimes sure. I get caught in my head instead of just pushing it out. Yeah, putting it out. Yeah, when, yeah, I was, yeah. when I'm working with somebody, he, you know what I'm saying? I yeah. see what he doing. It's like, bet I'm about yeah, to yeah. match his energy. I'm about to, you know what I'm saying? But Working solo, you ain't got to wait for nobody. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You go out here, motherfucker. If you feeling good, you motherfucker record the, you know what I'm saying? Hell you record yeah. right there in the studio. You might bump in, you know what I'm saying? Anything yeah, might happen. Hell yeah. But like, I wanted to get on the uh, the Big Keith situation. Like, I had recorded that song, Get Bought on this New Year's Eve. All right. You feel me? I was, 2019? Uh, going to 2020? This, uh, coming in this oh, year. okay, okay, okay. Coming in this year, 2020, New Year's Eve. I recorded it at uh, my homeboy Milo studio. Just feeling good, you know what I'm saying? Get bought on, bitch. Yeah. So, um, that night, 
me, uh, my homegirl, my nigga Tom, we got a motherfucking uh, Narbar. All right. And we see Keys walking out while he walking in and shit. The whole time going to Narbar, we listening to the song and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then I see this dick. I'm like, damn. <laughs> so I'm like, you a motherfucking legend around this bitch, you know what I'm saying? Chopping sure. it up with him like real nigga, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I hit him up in the DM and shit. I'm like, bro, I got a song about the. If you don't mind me sending it to you, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Hop I love on, you. Yeah. I'd honor for you to hop on this bitch. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Man, we put that shit together. New Year's Day. Yeah, hell yeah. Put that bitch right on that bitch. Man. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. Because you got motherfucking... So you got two niggas in this bitch who cold in the city, dog, that you just bumped on the humbug, like... Bro, it was... <laughs> like I said, that... Rio it, it, and, when you uh, working. Keys, yeah. Off some working shit. You know what I'm saying? Fresh out the studio. Yeah, because that Keys at my time, niggas be sleeping on that bitch. That first Miss Tape he had, dog. Then the one he had with uh, him and Payroll. What's yeah, that shit called? Some brothers. Billboard brothers. Dog, oh, yeah, yeah. Like, killed that shit for sure. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So with this project yeah, you just put out, dog, you gonna sit on it for a little bit and promote it heavy or you gonna hurry up and try to put some more shit out this year? Like, cause some niggas be like, man, I'm gonna sit with this bitch, put videos out, blase blee. Man. Are you gonna be like, man, fuck it, I'm about to move on to the next shit. I ain't gonna lie, being a, little, being a new artist, I definitely like got into that dilemma. I'm gonna say this, man. Being an artist, the easiest part is the music. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The hardest part, like, 75, 80% of it is like everything else that comes back behind it. Like, yeah, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? The business, when I'm going to do this, it was like, shit, you'll find yourself sitting on a bunch of songs. It's like, when the fuck I'm going to... Yeah, when I'm drop this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like, I like the song, but you know what I'm saying? Or I might not like the song, but yeah. the world might love it. Yeah, hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? You get, you run into all them type of dilemmas and shit. So, um, that was my, like I said, my first project. I wanted to put something out there. I felt weird being out here like, hey, I'm an artist. I do this yeah. and that. It's like, where your shit? It's like. Yeah, shit. Yeah, hell yeah. That's the shit. Yeah. So, that, you know what I'm saying? That was me this yeah. time last year. Yeah, that's like me with the podcast, man. I got podcasts. Come on. We got some episodes? Uh, shit. You know uh, what I'm saying? What you got to show for? No. You know what I'm saying? So, so I had to put my niggas on, like, nigga, first six episodes is niggas I know. Like, but doing something, I'm like, all right, bet I'm going to do it. Because these niggas going to say, yeah, they know me. Mm -hmm. So do it like that. So that's why I can start sending it to different niggas and be like, dog, you know, I got a podcast, nigga. Hell yeah. But at first, like, yeah. It would be like Rap City in the basement, nigga. Hell yeah. <laughs> got that niggas coming to be freestyling in a minute. Shit, man, if y'all oh, want yeah. to, nigga, shit. <laughs> I'm oh, about yeah, to be no easy, nigga. The, the floor is yours, Trice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nigga, shit, that's like, come on, they be ready. Oh yeah, but like, oh, yeah, they be ready, yeah, dog. They be ready and shit. So, nigga, with that shit, dog. So, you already answered that question. That's what, uh, kind of. What's some shit that you don't like, nigga? That you gotta do with this music shit. Like, what's some shit you don't like? You don't like, like hoe ass niggas or like niggas who be lying. Like, what's some shit you don't like about being in, uh, uh, in the rap shit? Um. <laughs> Man, so far, I, I, I enjoy it, man. Yeah. It's just like anything else in life, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's politics and everything, you know what I'm saying? School, you know what I'm saying? Motherfucking yeah. work. Hell yeah, you got to have you your everyday shit. On, yeah. all, on all different levels, so. You got to make room for everything. You know what I'm saying? It's, it, it, it just come with the game, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You learn you learn different things. But. See, my only thing, though, like when you're doing music, like anything, nigga, I like... You got 9-5, you work that bitch, but shit, make sure you go hard on what you do when you get to the crib. Oh, yeah. Because niggas be making other niggas rich and shit, but then don't focus on what they need to do for they self. Mm -hmm. Y'all man, fuck that job. <laughs> and that's, I get, a, that's, a, that's the reason I got into the music, because yeah. it's like... Because I'm always giving you a C-plus performance at work. Man, <laughs> I ain't gonna pass, lie, nigga. graduated college, all C's damn near. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> C's to succeed. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. you, you don't want to get into those type of um you don't want to have those type of uh habits yeah. in, in life though you oh, know yeah, what I'm saying? Sure. you yeah, don't yeah. want to have that so that's what that's something that kind of got me into music yeah. you don't want to have a c to succeed because you won't succeed like that in music yeah for sure it might yeah, work yeah. at work fast, it might have got you through school you know what i'm saying yeah. it'll get you through certain things but if you want to take it to the next level you know what I'm saying? At work, you could put give an A plus performance, but they still go yeah pay you whatever your rate yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, ain't gonna change. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So that that was a big reason why I got into music, man. That's something that can't nobody take from you. If you yeah. know you giving a hundred and ten percent, yeah, can't nobody take what you you know what I'm saying. For what sure. you got coming from you? Yeah, man. What y'all what y'all niggas need in the studio? In y'all studio sessions, dog. Some hoes, some food. Man, no, weed. I don't need, I don't need nothing I, for I real. Weed, a little bit of weed. Some drink. Some food, yeah, that's it. That shit don't right. fuck y'all up, like nigga. We, I remember one time I was drinking a little bit too much. I kept fucking up. Yeah, 
Hell no. I be, I be already ready for it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I go, I go to the studio like prepared, man. Time, it's, it's money. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I look at this. When I go to the studio, that's like work. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So I'm not going in there playing no games. I'm not going in there like, uh... Let me hear that. Like yeah. I'm going there. I know what beat I want to go off of. I know, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. I'm, I'm ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, nigga, you talking about College Hill, bro? <laughs> yeah, man. I know you remember the show making a band. Hell yeah. Cheesecake walking ass niggas and shit. Man, yeah, I man. just talked about that in one of my songs. And y'all already <laughs> talked about y'all did a, a little group project. So I'm gonna ask both of y'all niggas if y'all had to do a making a band yourself and three other niggas, dog, who would it be? Like your dream team, nigga. One album. You talking about like anybody any in the artist? Or are yeah. niggas that any we know? artist in the world, nigga? Give me Drake. Three niggas. Days Loaf and Lil Baby. Matter of fact, it's five people, so you got to name one more. Because um, five niggas in the band. Dollar on nigga. He just was missing a lot, so niggas don't know. So we got me, Drake, Days Loaf. Who else I said? Lil, Lil Baby. Baby. And a fifth one. You going to go with that line? No, <laughs> 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 Um, or oh, you want to keep it full, nigga, because you can't think of it. Yeah, that's an all star lineup right there. <laughs> Who else I'm throwing on that team? Uh, did I say Roddy Rich? Give me Roddy Rich. No, Roddy, oh, yeah, he, yeah, oh, yeah, that's a good one. Give what about Roddy you, Rich? I see you pondering this shit. All right, um, <laughs> that's for sure going uh, quadruple you platinum. Five, I, can make, I can choose five niggas or four. four yeah, niggas, you, you, right. you make five. All right, me. I say, like I said, I'm fucking Strudel or Wine. Wow. Jay Z. Yeah. Um, yeah, baby, you got Hove on your baby team. Face Ray. All right. You got the Hood. Okay. And Drake. <laughs> Drake. Okay, so y'all fuck with Drake, huh? Yeah, I mean, like, shit, he made hits. Yeah. I have to throw Days Loaf in for the city, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Days Loaf. Yeah. She don't get her flowers every, like she deserves. Every song he hop on. Oh, no, every song, everything he get on is going That's what I'm saying. straight go, like, nigga. Why not? <laughs> no, I'm on there, you feel me? Hell yeah. What's name of the, what's name of the all projects though? What's name of it? Like if, with that group, what's the you 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 in charge of making the name of the album, nigga? What is it? The Greats. On the spot. <laughs> <laughs> what's your shit, cuz? The name of the album. Yeah. Or like, um... <laughs> hot, hot as fuck, nigga. <laughs> no, hot that, talk, nigga. That's deep though. You feel yeah, hell yeah, no, I already know. The Greats. Can't be that simple though. <laughs> That's too simple. Hey, cause you got Jay Z on your on your shit, so it can't be you no know, simple shit. He can be man, fuck this, cause. I mean, the name of the album probably be some crazy shit like the Apocalypse. Yeah, some some wild you know shit. What I'm saying like, like yeah, like, like, it's the end of the world. <laughs> yeah. All this shit. Hell yeah. Really, really, like, now, no, before we get to the end of this shit, bro, can you fuck with a chick heavy and still be going hard at what your passion is? Um. Like, I'm talking about the beginning, like the beginning stages of your motherfucking, of your music shit. Like, can you fuck with a chick heavy as hell? Or it depends on the type of chick you fucking with? Man, it just depends, man. I yeah. deal with a lot of yeah. chicks. Yeah. I mean, she, <laughs> the chick I'm fucking with, she been fucking with me since I started this shit, so. Yeah. I say, like, it just take a lot of understanding. Hell yeah, because she, then she gonna be a lot of times when you gonna be, like, passionate about some shit. And she might be look at it like you be out too much. Yeah, hell yeah. But you like, I gotta really gotta go here, gotta go here, and then she be like, yeah, you know, she not because <laughs> it's not her passion. Yeah, for sure. So she ain't, you she ain't, she ain't so looking, looking like, like how you looking yeah, at it. So it's like sometimes they will they don't they don't see your passion, you yeah. know what I'm saying? And they think you just you bullshit. Yeah, out here just doing shit. We're really just like it just depends. Take a lot of networking. So it's like. Understanding, like then once you once they go out there with you, and they start seeing this shit. I say you gotta start taking it with you. Oh yeah, nigga, seeing, yeah. A lot of niggas say that shit. Yeah. Then, then they then they start seeing what's or going on. Or they'll be like, man, you know what? I don't even want to fuck with you because right. <laughs> that's what I mean. they, either, they either gonna start coming or they gonna be like, nah, I'm straight. Yeah. They know they gonna be like, just take too long. Like, yeah, yeah. you gonna be there all night. You gonna be gotta wait to perform. You gotta do all this Hell shit. Yeah. You talking to different people. <laughs> she like, like nigga, you I'm walking know. around. You not sitting down. So now she tired and Hell shit. Yeah. She's like, Ain't no one do you. Do you feel me? So it's like, hell yeah. So you say, man, fuck the hoes. I'm just fucking hoes. Like, <laughs> yeah, he's, uh, no, hey, what's the wild, what's the silliest shit y'all did to keep a chick from leaving y'all niggas? From leaving? Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. A bitch wanna leave you, nigga. What you? You ain't got your key sweater on. Douches. Oh, see, I ain't fake. I ain't fake uh, cry, nigga. I ain't fake cry. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think. That's a wild shit. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hey, the, the maker okay. check. The maker stay. The tank. I'm leaving your ass here. <laughs> to make her stay. <laughs> the crazy shit I did. I'm trying to think, bro, because I'm like, I don't know. This ain't some shit I do. <laughs> 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 the wrong I used to be mad. She left like, bitch, you stupid. <laughs> right. Me, so it was like, yeah. I can't really say make her, make her stay. I ain't cry. I think that shit was gonna work. It ain't work. Oh, then you look stupid. Shit. Hell, like damn. This motherfucker, I tell everybody I did this. Oh. <laughs> and then it worked. Mm-hmm. You say, you say, fucking go ahead and leave. <laughs> Man, I think, I think, I, I think. I, Bitch, a letter or some shit. Yeah, that's always a platinum little yeah, form, you know, because yeah. niggas rap, so we, I, I wrote some rhyme and shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Some, some poem ass shit. Sort the tour on the side. Yeah. No, did it work? Sort of kind of shit called me. You feel no, me? No, you know, it still ain't work out. Yeah. But, you know, Hell you know, no. Got attention. All right, though, we got a statement called This or That, though. You got to pick one. <laughs> All right. Nigga, uh, ass or titties? Ass. Ass. <laughs> These niggas twins that bitch. Dark skin, light skin. Light skin. Damn. I'm racist. Ch- I fuck with the chocolate. Yeah, I, like, I, I got some chocolate in my life, dog. Man, fuck with the chocolate. All right, car or crib? Uh. <laughs> talking about like paying off all the No, no, no. You got to choose one, nigga. You can have your own car or your own crib, nigga. <laughs> Damn, Damn, I got a car. You got the car staying with moms or you got the crib catching the bus? Damn. The Uber <laughs> out. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm gonna have to do the car, bro. I'm about to say, yeah, I, I gotta make move money around. with that car. Well, I gotta I, be on the I move. Go, the the crib. I ain't stack my cheese up, get a crib. Man, you with that you know, <laughs> car, that bus, bro? It's yeah. hard to get money on it. You can't get money, bro. <laughs> it's hard to steal. Bro, you it's can't get no money, steal. bro. Man. Like, you gotta wait and stack a couple months you taking the bus, then yeah. get a car. Like, that's too much time. Yeah, for sure. Get the car. Give me the car. I get yeah. it Yeah. 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 All right, shit. Wendy's or McDonald's? Wendy's. Wendy's that lemonade. It's strawberry. <laughs> yeah, bitch, be good, dog. Salad or tea? You, you said, said salad what? or tea? No, no, salad, baby. Salad oh. or tea, grizzly? Uh, salad. salad. I feel like tea don't get his flowers. Yeah, it cold, but yeah. All right, baby face or payroll? Give me gray. All right, damn, y'all niggas are disrespectful. <laughs> All right, weed or drink? Weed. You said drink, weed on yeah, everything. Drink the weed. Like liquor? Yeah. Oh, weed. Yeah, weed All right, nigga. All right, last me. one. KD or Steph? Oh, give me. <laughs> give me Steph out the last night. Man. Nigga, hard. Turned up and still I don't lost. Know, man. Because <laughs> that, nigga, that nigga Steph be always be choking, bro. Low key in the final. So give me That's because they be quadruple teaming. <laughs> Duh. Even when he was open, bro, it's a lot of moments where nigga he choked, bro. Yeah. It's a lot of moments, bro. He choked. KD don't really choke like that. Yeah. You right. And nigga that, with butter. I'm going with they Steph, both, though. They both got I'm it. I'm KD, going with Steph, though. That last shot count. Yeah. All right, nigga. Top three. Childhood crushes, nigga. Bitches, you. Uh, uh, girls, you. <laughs> like, like celebrity chicks. Oh, I thought you uh, meant like. Oh, no, not Keisha, from, from, not Keisha from down the street. Oh, nigga. Okay, damn. Uh, nigga, All right. Like, Monica from Woodward and shit, nigga. <laughs> no, no, Monica from Woodward. Christina no. Milian. Who? Christina Milian. Okay, okay, good one. Katie Albert. Who's that? Uh, the chick from Friday. She was in a couple of the uh, Which one? rap videos. She was oh, the, the third one. That's the last one. Yeah. Uh, Cat Williams yeah. chick. Yeah. Yeah, you know her name, so you really like her, nigga, yeah. Because I just know her as the third chick on Friday. Yeah, it's like KD. Like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, yeah. what's the last Whenever one? Whenever she uh, ready to settle down, you know what I'm saying? Be with an HP nigga. I'm right here. I'm ready. I'm waiting. <laughs> no, got no kids. I'm single. Hell yeah. You get it popping. Hell yeah. But, uh... <laughs> Well, last one, I'll probably put uh, Maya on there, man. Oh, it might still bad. Bitch. Still bad. It still. slept on Maya, man. What about, what about you, bro? I'm going to have to do. I'm over that's here. A, that's a mean ass like, list um, right there. Hell yeah, yeah. No, you got to uh, go. Which, which one the Fresh Prince? The dark skin oh, uh, daughter? Ashley. Oh, Ashley Bank? Yeah. Ashley. Yeah. yeah, she was called. Hell yeah. Ashley uh, Ashley is. Stacy Dash. Stacy. Coming up. And. I just had it. <laughs> and I lost what I say. Stacey <laughs> Ashley, nigga from... Ashley. Oh, and uh, Lisa from Save by the Bell, the black girl. And that's Stacey Dash? That ain't Stacey Oh, damn. It ain't? No, that's different. Oh, that's I'm different tripping. Shit. 
Who Saved by the Bell. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah. I'm putting it together in my head. Okay, yeah. yeah. That's you good. You said when we was kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's good. No, hell no, hell no. Like, my my shit is... Uh, my shit that used to be on TV. One of mine is, though, is Topanga, bro, from Boy Meets Real. Oh, yeah, she was. Ah. Uh, she was bad. Topanga. Nigga. White witch, nigga. Good. White chick. <laughs> All right, give me y'all uh, top three uh, foods. That white said nigga good. I'm sorry. Lamb chops. Oh, that's who it was. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, that's probably sure what it was. Yeah, no, I was thinking of that because I was thinking about Friday. Uh, not Friday. Um, Shit. She was on Friday. The first yeah, one. She was a kid, she was a kid though. Kid. Yeah, yeah. I don't want really to think about I think that. Deep, she was fine yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Another hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, top three fools, dog. Lamb chops from Panty. Hey, that's one. Yeah. Oh, I both of y'all. I fuck with the uh, chops. Panty and lamb chops is something different. <laughs> yes, sir. I got a song about them. <laughs> Facts. Um. Man, I ain't never really thought about it after the this. Truck. Man, shout out to uh, Chef Nick at the Lobster Truck, man. Yeah, he be going truck. crazy. I can't hear about this shit. I got to get him, dog. Go check him out one time, roll. man. Shit, Lobster Roll? Yeah, with lobster. I was going to say, follow him on the ground. Damn, how much that shit cost, though? $25. I was about to say, I know it got to be. It just depends. You get a half roll for like $12. Okay. You know what I'm saying? You got the lobster bites, the lobster mac and cheese. Get the whole roll, bro. Dog, you gonna be? You say you gonna you gonna feel good about it? If you get to have, you gonna be mad, bro. Yeah, like damn, I should. He be in different bitch. locations though. If you check his Instagram or whatever, he in different you locations said, uh, every Chef day. Nick? Yep, Chef Nick and the Lobster Food Truck, man. Shout out to him, man. Right. Oh yeah, and then uh, for my uh, my third, I'm just gonna say the Hibachi Truck. I just started fucking with it. It's my name, Fat Mike. Yeah. A Fat Mike. It would be a Fat Mike nigga. Yeah, yeah. My <laughs> <laughs> he got a Hibachi Truck. He always be on, by my crib over there by Jefferson and shit. So yeah, ah shit, I be riding coming from the store. I see that bitch pull up. <laughs> Nigga be chasing that bitch down Bro like, <laughs> God nigga that shit good as hell He make that shit just like I been in um, Osaka nigga For real That shit be hit for my, for my last one I'ma uh, shout out to my good people At the Jamaican pot man yeah. Over there on 8 Mile Fuck with that Yeah man I forgot yeah, to man. say that. Parkside Oh yeah, man. Parkside County too. That's, the HP that's our that's our that honorary spot. Yeah, 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 that's yeah, that's that bitch that got shot up a thousand times. Man, so every right summer, now, man. Always come back. That bitch got cars ran through that bitch. <laughs> Everything. They always come back strong and better. So, you know what? Do y'all know why they took the games out of Parkside County with these kids? Why? Niggas because because niggas was betting on Street Fighter and taking and was losing and shooting up the county. Duh. Yeah. I swear to God, bro. Wow, hell, the game. Bro. I was crying. I was a kid. I came in like, what the games? They, 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 he's shooting up. They shoot. I'm tired of them shooting. <laughs> <laughs> Take away the games. Hell Bad duh. business. I was like, man. Duh. Fuck as hell, duh. Nigga shot up the game. That is a throwback, though. No. Nah. There used to be video games and then everybody. Oh, yeah. Time. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That shit ain't nowhere now, nigga. Yeah, nigga. That's crazy. Shout out to bitch up, nigga. Shout out to Parkside, dog. Yeah, shout out to motherfucker, uh, old school, uh, <laughs> motherfucker arcade and shit, dog. Nigga being that bitch heavy as hell. Hey, shout out to my, uh, my people at, um, Ready Player One. That's yeah. a new, um. Oh, yeah. That's that shit on Wilbur, ain't it? On the downtown. Nope. It's right in the hood. It's on Wyoming, right oh, off the shit. lodge. Yeah, it's a, uh, that's a little new, arcade, bro, right? Yup, it's a new spot. It's a cigar bar on one side, and on the other side, it's a uh, video lounge. Yeah. And how they got it set up, it's, um, shit, a bunch of uh, old school video games. Dreamcast, Sega Genesis, oh, shit, Sega Dreamcast. Hard. It's probably about 40 TV screens. You got to get your own that. little sit in there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But I'm yeah, fuck with that shit. They got some good food? Uh, yeah, they ain't got no food, but it's uh oh, okay. like 420 family, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, be yeah, wild. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, dog, give me y'all top three moments in life, nigga. Top three moments in life? That's life. Uh, graduating, that was a big moment for sure. Uh, finishing college, you know what I'm saying? That was big for me. I achieved something that. Put my mind to, yeah, you know what I'm sure. saying? Yeah, yeah. Did for something sure. big for my family. They yeah. wanted me to achieve. Hell yeah. Um, shit. Doing music for real, man. Yeah. That was that was a big I'm about thing. Say, I know you about to say that. That was a big thing. Like really just stepping away from everything that everybody was telling me yeah. to do. You know what I'm saying? Kind of going yeah. against the grain. Yeah. Just really standing on that shit, man. Um, and um, I say moving back from 
Kentucky to Detroit. Yeah. That was that was life changing, man. Hell yeah, yeah. Um, Cause you yeah, you going back to where niggas say you can't, you know, get, you know. It was different, bro. Like coming back from Kentucky, I was it was like moving to the jungle. <laughs> you know Hell what yeah, I'm for real. Like That's going true. from having fucking being harassed by the police and yeah. moving, like, you know what I'm yeah, saying? To yeah. niggas being out here like the wild, wild. Oh, no, for real. Hell yeah, nigga. You know That's a fact. Hell yeah. Man, it was, it was like traumatic at first, you know what I'm saying? But it was like, I'm from Detroit, so I was like, I'm about to move. I know what's going yeah, on. Yeah, like, I get I know right. what the fuck was going on. Yeah, I ain't know what the fuck was going on. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. My but, thing is, though, you, if you can make it anywhere, nigga, you can make it in this bitch. Like, and, you know, if you can make it Detroit, you can make it anywhere else. Mm -hmm. If you you know what I'm saying? If you can if you can maneuver and move around, shit, everything else is light work, nigga. Yeah, shit, yeah. As long as you on your grind, you good. Like I said, we came from Highland Park. That's where Detroit people like. <laughs> yeah. So you yeah, be good. Yeah, what, all what, the way back to the green, man. What, what your top three tracks? You got one? Uh, shit. First time I got high. <laughs> man, <laughs> nigga, I was with my pops. Um, eighth grade, eighth grade graduation, nigga, <laughs> at Liberty. Damn. Yeah, I never forget that shit, nigga. He had rolled up some weed and shit. <laughs> He's like, you want to hit it? I'm like, nah, I'm straight. And he, I'm like, I'm like, fuck it, I hit it. So I done smoked the weed. For, forgetting we got to walk across the stage, nigga. So, <laughs> Dog, nigga smoke I'm, a bowl. Bro, my first time, so this is my first time getting hot, bro. I feel like I was going to fall off the stage, nigga. I don't, you know how you pull when you walk after you get your uh, little diploma and shit? Yeah. You're supposed to like shake, shake all the Shake it by hand. hand. <laughs> I walk past all the niggas. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, yeah, it's hell around. Everybody yelling and shit. I'm hot in the motherfucker. I'm like, nigga, so I'm looking up. at the crowd. Nigga feel like it look like it's a million niggas in that bitch. <laughs> I'm like, man, I'm thinking in my head, like, damn, why the fuck I smoked that weed, man? Went back, went back shook everybody's hand and shit, walked off the stage, bro. I was sick. Duh. I was sick, so that was one for sure. And then graduating and shit, because I went through a lot of shit in high school. Yeah, save, save, for, then, your, save for your interview, dog. And then my, <laughs> uh, my, having my daughter. My daughter and shit. Oh, yeah, oh, you, got, you got one kid? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what's up. What's Hell up? yeah, you gotta make sure you be that, be that nigga for real, dog. You feel me? So, yeah, yeah, I got a little girl now, nigga. I got two boys and a girl, nigga. That girl bring, nigga bring a softness in you, nigga. I'm that bitch, like, damn, I'm soft as hell, but I love it, nigga. I love that shit, bro. Like, I love having kids, yeah. nigga, cause that shit is just a different look. That shit is a different experience, yeah. especially when that girl come out. When that girl came out, I swear to God, nigga, I about to cry, like, damn, I got two boys, nigga. I'm like, all right, bet we got, I got a son. That girl came out, I'm that bitch, like, damn. <laughs> nigga get the wiping like damn it's hot in here like, nigga that girl different dog cause nigga like me and this one lady was talking at her job like nigga that girl gonna look at you and nigga and nigga, be like damn you know what I'm saying yeah, yeah. yeah so you gotta be on your shit you know what I'm saying for sure for sure facts man. give me y'all top three hoopers ever ever hell yeah um, y'all in the hooping and shit Iverson over. gotta go on the list for sure Iverson sure. Um, so you got everything you got Jordan man Mike Kobe Mike, Mike for too. sure I remember being a young nigga with my uh, Jordan 14 zone yeah. my pops over here I'm got his bets with the dude. Utah Jazz I'm yeah, sitting there in front of the TV like yeah, yeah. you know this nigga Mike about to hit me yeah. Him motherfucking poking, uh, Carbolo bitches, man, man dropping I, Brian Russell, hell yeah, hitting the shot, man. I'm sitting there, my dad's just looking like, What the fuck? Yeah. I'm like, I told you, yeah. Michael fucking Jordan, hell yeah. Michael Jordan for sure. Um, Can't take Jordan off of there. The coldest nigga, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna say my three, the coldest nigga I ever seen hoop, yeah, and was cold at a young age. Rest in peace. Uh, I don't know, y'all know it. From Holland Park, Jerome Parker. Jerome Parker. Shout out yeah. to my nigga Jerome nah, Parker, man. That nigga was a beast. That nigga, yeah. was, that nigga was, was an HP he, legend he was, for sure. He, sure. he was like, all right, he was on. Yeah, he, he was, was on. A, he had him probably like a year or two. He was, he was a year older than was, this. Nigga was on one fucking JV. I mean, he was on varsity that in ninth grade. Different, yeah, bro. He was dunking. I'm talking about, bro, we used to, we, we used to go to Holland Park. Duh. And you couldn't even get on the court. Like, niggas, and he was in ninth grade going to get grown niggas, killing niggas all day, bro. Damn, rest in peace, bro. Like, nigga, I hooped against the nigga one time, nigga. Go, everything I love, nigga. <laughs> Mr. Truth Lord, I always tell niggas this story. I'm like, the nigga was cold, bro. I had 19, nigga. I was playing against him, his brother and shit. And he was like, I'm about to go get my brother in. He was like, just wait. I'm going to get my brother. I'm like, I'm thinking in my head, like, I got 19. Ain't no motherfucking way this nigga about to come. <laughs> yeah. so that nigga was bro, like that for sure. Like, like, over there, bro. And he scored did not want to play. No, he went with quick, that nigga. Went crazy. Quick, quick as shit. nothing, bro. Dog. 
promise you. I'm like, damn, that nigga cold. Rest Every time peace, I seen man. him, who? He was he just killing, busting ass. All right, young AC Every legend. Time. Man, man. I'm, I'm sure everybody who hoop at Highland Park got a uh, Jerome Parker story for sure. Damn, he was yeah, a baller. that shit be fucked up. Yo. He passed away young? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, that shit. I want to say he was 16. Oh, shit, 15. damn. That was hella young. Yeah, rest in yeah. peace, huh? Yeah. Check. Uh, who, your, who your third? You said Iverson Mike? Iris and Mike, um, at this point in life, I got to throw Kobe in there, man. Yeah, that's my nigga, dog. I, I'm just not a big fan of the Lakers. You know what oh, I'm saying? Come on, cuz. Come on, bud. I ain't no that's big Lakers fan, I love man. Lakers. Man. Ever since I was like 10, nigga. Uh, I was a... Motherfucker, A. Jones in that bitch. Nick Van, nigga. I was in that bitch. Loving Lakers. Man, they had to. I love the Shaq and Kobe run, but when they ran into Pistons, I had to choose, choose yeah, sides. I, you know what I'm saying? I, I chose sides. It was about 400, nigga. <laughs> ben, like, nigga, they about to blow these niggas out. <laughs> Mad as hell, nigga. Ben killing Shaq, beating this shit. Man, I had to stay with them on board. Man. Man. man, for real, dog. But I got a lot of respect for Kobe, all dog, all man. Workout it, play yeah. hurt. Nigga, you know I was on saying? the show, nigga, when I found out he passed away. Right after this motherfucker was over, dog. My nigga Easy Fresh, he be rapping. I would look at my phone like, nigga, what? That's These niggas lie. over here lying. Then nigga ESPN, nigga Channel Two. I'm like, what? Nah. Like, dog. I, that, everybody remember that shit. I nigga, was, I gonna... was on my way to church with my mom's. Yeah. I remember we had stopped. We was about, you know, I get the church running late. Yeah, she yeah, sitting yeah, in the yeah. car yeah. looking at me like Kobe. Dog. <laughs> oh, Kobe, oh, yeah, that's I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. That's the first. That's the first dude that nigga I shared a tear for who passed away. It was outside my like my my, my family or my homies or something. Mm -hmm. I'm like, dog, this, you gotta understand, nigga. This the nigga I came into. Nigga was talking about Mike, but this the nigga I really grew up with. Yeah, watching, Kobe, like, for sure. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Seen him come in. Boy. Hell yeah. But nigga, I'm mad as hell. My mom, I want a Lakers jersey. She give me a check. Nigga, get my brother a Kobe. I mean, that bitch mad. Like, damn. Dog, I ain't want no fucking center. Like, <laughs> <laughs> dog. You supposed to get him to Shaq and yeah. be Kobe. Dog, for real, dog. <laughs> now, we in everything off, dog, on a hot moment or a drunk moment, dog. A funny story when you was one, of, one or both. A uh, higher drunk moment? Yeah, or both, nigga. You was eat both them bitches. Mm -hmm. I got so many of them. Try to yeah, think of a good right. uh, college one. Yeah, it's always the college shit that niggas be getting fucked up on. Uh. I got, I got a drunk moment. <laughs> I remember one time I was so motherfucking drunk, nigga. I walked the motherfucker Turner Lane from uh, Davidson and Toast Street <laughs> all the way to Linwood. Now you on the freeway? I damn near. <laughs> I walked that whole turn the line like the whole yellow, the two yellow lines. I walked that whole bitch. Yo, what the fuck you drinking? I don't even remember. I was like sixteen. We just came from a party, bro. Damn, remember. so they got high, young, drunk, young. I, I never forget. I came to the motherfucking stop to the crib. My mom was like, "You hot?" I never forget. I looked at Dana. I was like, "Hell no." <laughs> I'm tired as hell. <laughs> and I walked out room with the sleep. Duh, fucked he was, up. He was like, nigga, I know you high. You was high. I'm like, nah, but I was just tired. I Duh. was walking like a motherfucker. I was drunk in a motherfucker, nigga. <laughs> nigga be a bitch. We used to go to, uh, Shit in high school, nigga, uh, Kiera, nigga, she used to have the craziest parties every weekend, bro. And I didn't even go to Holland Park, but yeah. my niggas went to Holland Park. Yeah. So, I used to go to the parties with these niggas every weekend. Every weekend we was at a party, bro. Like, come on, that shit was some wild ass parties, bro, <laughs> for some kids. There's some house parties, nigga. I, like. got, I got partied out at a young age, just off going off house parties, and you know, I got grown. I was tired of going to parties. I'm like, man, I too many man parties. I remember my, my we brought my brother to a house party. He was like eight, nigga, getting motherfucking ass thrown at him, like <laughs> ass the same height as that nigga. Like, damn, yeah, <laughs> she throwing that bitch in his face, nigga. He was eating ass. <laughs> like, nigga, early, nigga. Like, you got to take your brother to the party. Like, what? Fuck it. They never been throwing this nigga up in the air, dog. Everything, dog. That shit funny as hell, dog. That nigga, that bitch getting tossed around, nigga. Little ass nigga, dog. That's a wild What's your shit, bro? Man, I got so many of them. I don't even know where to begin. All right, I got a funny ass story. So, I'm in school down in Kentucky. It's like homecoming time. I got a bunch of my uh, boys from the D, you yeah. know what I'm saying, down here and shit. So, uh, we and her going crazy. Like, down there, it'll be like $2 drinks at the bar and shit. Yeah. I'm at the bar, $40, like, I got the next 20 ladies <laughs> at the bar, you know what I'm saying? We going crazy and shit. So, I got I got my people down there, we going crazy. What about homeboys and shit? He like, uh, man, this nigga funny as hell, I ain't gonna say his name, dog. You know who he is, dog. Yeah. This nigga funny as fuck. But, uh, we all about to take a picture and shit. Yeah. 
So this nigga, he tried to talk to this chick in the middle of the club and shit. Yeah. So I'm like, come on, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? He's like, hold on. You know what I'm saying? He's like, come on, baby. You about to get in this picture. Come get in this picture with me and everything. Whatever, yeah. right? So, dog. <laughs> the girl, she was like, you remember how you said she had the teacher with the, yeah. the chicken wing? Yeah. She had the chicken wing and shit. Oh, he didn't even know. She had the chicken <laughs> wing and the leg, right? Oh. So she come over there. He hold, we all over there posing. Yeah. We ready, like nigga, come on, yeah. get a laugh. He come like, come on, baby, come on. <laughs> he hop in the big bring her in the picture and shit. They snap that bitch, bloop, dog. Yeah. Nigga, we get the uh, the end of the night. She that bitch the highest man, like. What? She like who me? He like I remember, oh my god! I just remember him like come on baby. She like who me? Yeah. She came over there. She put her arm on her hip like. <laughs> No, that dog. nigga snapped that bitch, dog. dog. Niggas was laughing so hard. I couldn't wait to motherfucking the end of the night to get that picture, dog. <laughs> we got the picture. We ride home, dog. Niggas is drunk as fuck. I remember I was, uh, it was me, my nigga Keith. Okay, I think my nigga Bay was down. Didn't even analyze that bitch. And we went to, we went to motherfucking uh, McDonald's and shit. So oh, I get the yeah, pictures yeah. and the shit. Yeah. No, I'm thumbing through the bitches. I'm looking. I'm, we finally get to the light at the drive through. I'm laughing so fucking hard. Duh. I saw my nigga Keith. He drunk as fuck. He laughed so hard. He started throwing up. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga throwing up all in the McDonald's and shit, laughing. Man. Nigga <laughs> like what the fuck? I'm trying to show this nigga back. This nigga, this nigga like what, bro? What? We show the picture and shit, bro. I swear to God, this nigga gets up, Duh. goes to the dumpster at McDonald's and <laughs> toss that bitch. <laughs> Toss the picture in the dumpster, dog. Nah, nigga, that bitch, dog. That, that nigga, nigga dog. was hurt, well, you dog. You got too much liquor, dog. You you will laugh till throw up, nigga. Dog, we was <laughs> in the back dying, dog. Like, bro, because we go to the school, so we know that this nigga there feeling person. all good. He been talking like, yeah, I'm about to call baby and shit. She gave me your number and shit. Hey, dog, would you would you still smash that bitch if she was bad with the chicken wing? No, no, okay, ain't no chicken wing. I I do too much. <laughs> Actors, no chicken wing things. Scared, bitch, <laughs> like that. They got a limb. You scared I'm a herder. Nigga, bitch, you know, you're broke the chicken wing, dog. Like, uh, <laughs> she won't be able to keep up. You feel me? I wouldn't know what to do. I ain't gonna lie. You're like, you like, nigga, you gonna be waiting all the time. Damn, bro. Oh, man. <laughs> He's like, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm stuck. Bitch, turn around. Dog, that shit funny as hell. Dog, like, that shit was so either. funny. Why they got the throwing up? He laughed so hard <laughs> at the picture, dog. We never seen it again. Dog. That nigga, he got the that bitch that got right out the car and threw it right in the McDonald's dumpster. He was hurt. It Man. was a picture of the whole squad. Yeah. <laughs> he, he, he wrapped around like, I got a bad one. She ain't that bitch like, nigga winged out, yeah, nigga. No, he wasn't even blown. Oh, Damn, a little God, chicken wing in that dog. bitch, dog. Damn, that shit funny as hell. I bet you if you search Pornhub, chicken wing, chick, nigga, she go, <laughs> <laughs> chicken wing with a fat ass. She go, yeah, bitch. Fucked up, nigga. <laughs> Duh. Duh, man, that shit, man. college shit used to be funny, man. Man. Good times. Good I times. appreciate y'all niggas coming on this bitch talking man. shit, dog. Appreciate you Classic having story, us, man. nigga. Especially that shit with you in the fight, nigga. I can't. <laughs> man, that's a classic <laughs> ass HP uh, story nigga, right there, man. No, that nigga said he had a nigga headlock, nigga, off, off his feet, nigga. <laughs> man, I was fighting for my life. Dog, that shit funny as hell, dog. Where can they find y'all niggas on, on social media? Where they can't find the music? All that good shit, man. Man. Follow me on social media at Rio the Great. That's R I O T H A G R number eight. No spaces, no nothing. Rio the Great, the one the girls love and haters love to hate, man. Um, sure. My music is same name on all platforms YouTube, uh, fucking Apple Music, Spotify, Tidal, everywhere you look for me. My plan is to drop a, at least a new single every week, every two weeks, yeah. going into the summer. Um, I'm not, you know what I'm saying, no established artist out here, so I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying, just yeah. give people more and more to look yeah, look for sure. forward to from me, so, hell yeah, hell you know yeah. what I'm saying, check me out, hopefully by the end of the summer, it's at least one song that everybody rocking with. Hell yeah, you know hell yeah, you gotta be, you gotta put that work in. Yes sir, yes sir. Yeah. Where, where can't find you at, Trice Dub? Uh, shit, HP Trice on anything you can think of. Yeah. Just type my name in, yeah. RG, HP underscore. T R I C E Trice. Wow. Feel me? Real name. No gimmicks. Sign on. Let me stop. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man, shit. 
that's where you can find me. HB Charlie's Facebook, Instagram, iTunes, YouTube. I got videos coming out. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Video for Karen coming out. Video for Bust Down coming out. Uh, shout out to my nigga Cam Woods one time. Shout that Karen oh, yeah, video. Yeah, my nigga Cam Woods. Shout the Karen video. Yeah, we gonna we gonna get day. we gonna get this nigga uh, Trice back on the show, nigga, next month sometime. Shout the uh, oh yeah man. Video. Come kick it. Come tell we his life work, story man. and shit about how he was, you know, what I'm saying dog and hoes and shit. <laughs> Not just man. one, but all hoes. Hell yeah, nigga, for sure. Damn, why, why made you think I know about man? I don't know, nigga. You know, shit. I, I, guess it's true, cuz. <laughs> Man, but shit, man, what's some what's some shit. what's the last words you wanna leave people with, dog? Be great, stay in school, don't do drugs, what's some shit? Be safe, be great. Alright, shit, what about you, cuz? Fine, fine, fine what you good at it. And yeah. Be great, you feel me? Everybody got a gift. Yeah. Your gift might not be what everybody else's gift might be and shit, you know what I'm saying? Some people you could tell, you know what I'm saying? Like people got a gift they should do something when people force and shit. Don't force it. You know what you good at. Be good at what you good at. Don't try to be like everybody else. Yeah, yeah. My, mm-hmm. Shit, my shit, man, for 69, it's going to be like, dog, if you see that bitch with that wing, shit, try it out. Shit, it might be, <laughs> that bitch might be good, dog. Shit. <laughs> 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 that chicken wing. <laughs> <laughs> see what it is, nigga. Shit, shower today, buddy.